This is this can't be the scuffest stream ever, guys. Is this the peak scuffest stream ever? You saw nothing, right? You saw nothing. Actually, the stream just started. Hello, everyone. My name is Lucian Linares from FSP EN's first generation Avalum. <laughs> oh my god, how's everybody doing today? How's everybody doing today? Uh, 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 welcome to this wonderful stream. It's very nice to meet you. Any any new people in here? I feel like I've never seen you before. <laughs> Let me get some water pretty quickly. You know what day is today, right? You know what time it is. You know what time it is, right? It is it is time to have a date with Nouvellette. Am I saying it right? Nouvellette? I feel like I'll never get his name right. New Villette time? Yeah, it is. Yes, it is. Um, I do have... I have to admit something. I have something to admit. But before I do so, I want to say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good time zones to everyone. How's everybody doing today? I want to know. I want to know. Tell me in chat. What did you do? Tell me something. Something nice. Something to lift up my mood. My mood is already lifted up, but I want to see how the Lunarists are doing today. You're playing Genshin. Nice. You know, I've been enjoying my time playing uh, Nouvellet's off stream. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Chad. I'm sorry, Lunaris. I cheated on you. I played Genshin off stream. I actually played and it was not just dailies. I will talk about it a little bit after. <laughs> playing Genshin in Skyrim. You know, actually, mm, good games, good games, good games. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to say good games, good games. Working on watercolor painting of you. Oh. Ooh, I love art. Did you all know that I love art? I love artists. Artists are amazing. Woke up early, made soy milk plus peanut butter. Nice. That sounds like a nice breakfast. Box of choco. I like choco. What did I have today? Mm, let me let me remember. So I had I woke up. I woke up. I had some coffee. Um what else did I? I didn't really have a breakfast today. I think I skipped breakfast and then I went out for a little. I went out for a little. I was touching some grass. Um, unfortunately, I had to be under the, under the, you know, like the, the weather was not the best. So I, I, it wouldn't be unfortunate, but unfortunately, there's like bad news to that, the, the weather, right? I got wet because it was raining, but fortunately there was no light, so I didn't die. So here I am. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still alive. <laughs> the only times a vampire can really go out is when there's no light or when, it, when it's raining because there's no sun, right? <laughs> so yeah, thank God I didn't die. So yeah, I, I went for a little walk and uh, I came back. I had some, some food. I think I remember I had some mashed potatoes and chicken. I think, yeah, very, very simple. Very simple, yeah. Um, you know, I already told you, even though I'm a vampire, I'm not exactly... Like every single vampire. I can't, I, I don't remember exactly why. Why am I not just like the other vampires? Well, why am I not like the other vampires? Mom, why am I not like the other vampires, huh? Man, I get to be like a normal pet person just eating normal stuff. I get hungry like a normal person too. What does that mean? What does that mean, huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm just a silly vampire that's addicted to coffee and souls. I mean, what? <clears throat> coffee and, uh, and coffee, yeah. Mm-hmm, and coffee. I'm just addicted to coffee. What? What did he say? <laughs> but yeah, anyways, to the topic of Genshin Impact. Uh, I actually played a little bit off stream. Um, remember that last time? Last time we left on, we finished the quest to Liyue. So we finished with Liyue, and now we are, I believe, in a little interlude, which is like a filler episode, uh, before going to Inazuma. Right? Um, I believe the quest is something called Dainslef. Dainslef, I don't know the name of that person, but I believe we are meeting somebody. Uh, we are meeting somebody before going to Inazuma. Uh, however, obviously I didn't do the quest off stream, because I wanted to do it on stream. Um, but I did farm a little bit to get the, to craft the weapon for Nuvalent. 
Um, so he feels a lot more stronger. He feels a lot stronger now. Uh, so I lit a little grinding. We do a little grinding, you know, off stream. Um, so yeah, I find my, my 50 crystals or gems or whatever it's called. So yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to meet this new person, Dines, Dinesleff or Dainsleff. I don't know, I don't know their name, uh, but I'm excited. I'm excited to meet this person and to continue, you know, playing Genshin. I think we're at a, at a good part of the story before Inazuma. Um, I've heard that Inazuma is crazy, so I don't know if we will have, uh, uh, what's it called? I, I don't know if we will be able to make it today. I don't know if we'll have time to make it to Inazuma today. It depends on how... How long the interlude or, or the, you know, the side story is. So you tell me, you tell me. <laughs> Anyways, without further ado, sorry for making this a little longer than usual. Uh, let me go right into the game. Hopefully not, no, no other technical, technical issues here. Let me actually, actually, no, just wait a little longer. Just wait a little longer, so. <laughs> Inazuma is crazy. A lot of people say that. A lot of people told me that I'm gonna love Inazuma, actually. Like, the, the story, like, the story of the animations are crazy. About an hour plus? Oh, so maybe we will make it to Inazuma today. Here we go! And off we start. I'm gonna do my dailies first. Um, I maybe by the end of the day we will be able to do a temple. I, I'm not sure where I want to pull. To be honest, I'm gonna be honest with you. However, it doesn't matter wherever I pull because I believe I'm not getting anything. Oh yeah, I was using Ningguang instead of Fischl because she just breaks shields faster, <laughs> and I need <laughs> I need something that breaks shields. So, yeah, I'm just using Ningguang for now. But anyways, let's start checking everything that I have. Ba -da -da -dum. Oh, what is this? Lane line overflow, time remaining, the flow of experience. Oh, I kind of want this, though. We might want to do those, actually. Yeah, we might... Sumeru? Inazuma? Oh, okay, interesting. I also, I also, um changed my dailies i also changed my dailies to uh, be in monstat because it's definitely easier <laughs> it's definitely easier uh let's start with the one that's like over here look at my boy the legend the myth the water boy nuvelet he is so cool oh yeah let me show you let me show you what i did so uh talents is it artifacts weapon this is the one that i got uh, I believe this is the one the chat told me to get, right? Prototype Amber. For now. That's probably the best one I have for him. So, he looks pretty cool. He is so pretty, isn't he? Let's talk to Glory. Hello, Glory. Oh, sorry. You can't see me. Hi. Let's just do it. I don't want to do it. <laughs> this is just a daily. But he is very strong, like, you, you guys don't understand, I mean, you probably do if you play him. But he is so strong, and not just strong, but he's so fun to play. Um, we go back to the entrance? Wait, there's something here. Ooh, no, I don't want to sit. What are those books for, though? Someone who bought a $200 newbie cut out a stand and I can get it, oh my god. A $200 cutout? Like a cardboard stand or something like that? You know, actually, I was looking a little bit. I saw that uh, Mihoyo uh, dropped a trailer for uh, Arlequino. I think it's the name of the, the new character, right? Man, I would be lying to you if I said they don't look cool. Because they look insane. And I, I kind of want to roll for Arlequino, but I don't know if I can. I'm, I mean, I'm already like 10, 10 wishes into pity, so... I mean, it's not impossible. But I don't know if it's possible. Where am I supposed to go? Um, what was the quest again? 
What's the quest? I, I don't know what the quest is. Gloria misses her boyfriend who went along the journey. She's looking for a carry... For a way to carry her words to him. So where is her boyfriend? Do we have to, like, get these things? Maybe? Maybe this is what they want me to get? Or maybe they want me to talk to that guy? Huh. Well, that sucks, because if I have to do this, then I have to change my party a little bit. But I, I do have this here, right? Yeah. <gasps> She's dead. <laughs> She's dead. Um. Over here. Wait, what? Is that not animal? Is this character not animal? I believe this character is animal, right? Surprise. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's it. Okay, I just needed one. Alright, I just needed one. This is the first time that I get this quest, to be honest, so... Be patient with me, okay? Be patient. There we go. Then we go back to glory. I'm gonna be honest with the, the quests that, that, that require for you to walk for too much. I'm not really a big fan of those. It's probably one of the big turn off, turn, turn offs that I get in MMOs when you get quests that require you to go to a certain place and then go back and then go back again. Like, I feel like it's just too much walking. Like maybe back in the days it was fun but I feel like games need to evolve. Like, I don't mind walking to a place if it's for discovery, right? It's it's cool to walk to a place, but when they tell you to walk somewhere... Like, I, I'm not even done with this quest. And then you have to go to that place and then go back to the original place that gave you the quest. And it, it just becomes really annoying. What is that? I, I Have I never been there? Wait, hold on. I thought, I thought I actually... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> um, sir. There we go. Nice. Wait, what? Oh, that's where I was supposed to go. <laughs> I guess I'm solving the puzzle without knowing that I'm solving the puzzle. Bring this parcel to the next town. Say thanks for me back in your hometown. Say welcome back. Yeah, dude, it's the same thing. I swear. I freaking swear. It's like, go kill five boars for me. And then I have to go back to them instead of just... It's just... I don't know. It's just so old school. Did you do it? It was so windy up there. Okay. Alright. Finally. Okay, I was gonna say no way she's gonna send me somewhere else. Let's go to... Wait, actually. Um... Let's go here. I feel like I haven't really done much grinding in this game. So there's like there's like a lot of things that I've probably skipped. I did also um I killed the fire the fire vine. What what's it called again? Uh, I don't know the name. Pyro, pyro, something. Time to act. Pyro Regis Vine, yes. No, my sword. Ring cutter. Look at that much damage I do. It's crazy. Your head. 
He's so cool. He's just so cool. <laughs> it's so it makes the game so much easier too. <laughs> the amount of that I, I, I just like as soon as I got this character the game just turned easy mode <laughs> oh hell yeah I love being a new player I love playing this game for the first time and one shotting everything heck yeah I love it let's go um here Now we go this way. Oh, we gotta do, we gotta fight these people. Especially once I got the new weapon. The Amber, Amber, Proto Amber or something. Like everything just turns suddenly super easy. I'm sorry, I'm not supposed to fight you. Commission accepted. Defeat eight opponents. Oh, it's my time to shine! Wait, I skipped the animation! Wait, that's so cool! Huh? How did I do that? Hey, wait a minute. I paid for the animation, bro. Come on. How are you gonna skip my animation? I, I use my money. <laughs> yeah, I pay for for my anime my animation with gameplay. Okay, it's time time for you, 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 and then you. This thing that just it doesn't care about shields. Do you guys see that? It doesn't care about shields. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I was so confused for a second. There's two of them. Who cares? I usually do my best to avoid Nobody cares if there's two. I'll kill them both at the same time. Stop talking. Stop talking. I don't care. Okay, where's the next... Where's the next one? Oh, it's right here. This guy, this guy is talking. Wait, level two friendship? Wait, where? Are we already together for life? Oh, newbie's detail. Oh, really? I didn't even notice. How do you how do you get friendship? More voice lines. Interesting. I didn't even know that was a thing. Good to know. And here. Silence. Silence. Hmm. Feel like he's about to tell me silence, mortal, mortal, or something like that. <laughs> he actually kind of sounds like Yugi. I summon. <laughs> Is it me though? Is it just me? All right, come here, come here, come here. Come here, come here. Very fun gameplay, very fun gameplay. Here we go. Are you all sure? Who, who's the voice actor for this guy? Who's the voice actor for this guy, chat? Ray Chase. He's pretty good.
I don't know about you, but he's pretty good. Damn, that was an instant response. Like, you're all, like, insta, like, big fans. That's crazy. He voiced Sukuna. Oh, I've never watched uh, JJK in English. So I wouldn't know. Thank you for completing. Ad Astra Abyssos. That's all I hear. Um, I really don't care about these expeditions, to be honest. Maybe I should. But, I mean, I'm getting infinite money every day, so, you know. I just, I just keep dispatching. Level 15! Imagine if I actually paid for this. That would have been crazy. I'm getting a lot of things for this. Do I have any wishes? Like, any normal wishes? I don't. But I have a hundred, which means that we might be able to get a ten pull after after everything we do. Um, and maybe if we're lucky, we'll get a dine uh, a dine slave. We might get a another nuvilet. Alrighty. So what is next? What do we do next? Let me. I think I'm gonna spend all my resin. Actually, um, I want the exp books. Uh, where do I where do I get those? I believe I have to go... Oh, yeah, I killed this thing, too, by the way. The Oceanid off-stream. I did a lot off-stream. I usually don't play games off-stream. So, I think it's right here. Yeah, this one. Yeah, I usually don't play games off-stream, so... Goes to show... I like Genshin Impacts. How do I go down there? Do I have to go through this? I guess I do. How do I go upstairs? Oh, it's through here. Maybe I'm taking the long road. No, oh, hello, buddy. Um... Is there another upstairs? I... I don't think so, right? There's no another... Oh, there is another upstairs. You kill Oceanid with Nuvillet? No, it was with Fischl, actually. <laughs> Nuvillet died instantly. <laughs> he didn't do anything. He couldn't. He just couldn't do anything. Thanks to Fischl, though. Uh... Fischl and, um, Shanling. I think that's how you pronounce her name. <laughs> Feed all opponents. Oh, they're kind of tanky, though. Wait, no, they're not. No, my sword. <laughs> Wait, did I just use it two times? Is that normal? Did I use his uh, Shinsho's ability two times? Oh, whoa, whoa, how dare you touch me like that? Sacred so oh wait, that's actually insane then. Right, are you gonna move up here or what? Destroy them all! Yeah, this character is very fun. Just Hydra Pump everyone. <laughs> Just Hydra Pump anyone. X2, let's go. Ooh, that's a lot of books. I kinda... I kinda want more. Where's the other one? Oh, I have to go this way, right? Yeah. Woo! They almost got me. You are enjoying this too much, I think. Well, yeah. I feel like I probably wouldn't have been playing Genshin Impact. 
if it wasn't for Nuvelet. Um After after Zhao, I feel like this uh, this is probably my second most favorite character. So it's legally yours now. Oh. And there we go. Settle down. And there we go. Let the mighty be humble. Oh my god, that hurts. It's okay, I can just heal it back. Bow your head. Can I just not charge this? I guess I have to charge it all the time. Ow, that hurts. Rain outlines your fate. The only sad part about this is that this guy doesn't do any damage with like normal auto attacks. That is the only part that sucks. Where else do I have to go? It's backwards. It's this way around. Did he go to Fontaine? I haven't gone to Fontaine yet. Ooh. Wait, do I want to? No, I don't think I gain anything from finding them. Um, I did hear that I can go to Fontaine instantly. However, I haven't seen the need to go to Fontaine yet. Oh, come on. No, my sword. <gasps> she almost died. I think she would have died if I didn't give her... Um, uh, what's it called? The shields. The tides beckon. Oh no, he canceled it. Oh wow, they're fast. And will it do more damage if I go to the head? No, not really. An oversight on my part. Oh, can he stop spinning? God damn! Okay, buddy. I get it. Bay Blade. How many more? How many more can I do? Wait, actually, before I go, this is a this is a gold mine, or should I say, crystal mine? Give up. I wish I had something better to do this, to be honest. But it's okay. I mean, it's a lot. Nice, okay. What else? How many more can I do? Um, I don't want to go past the, the limit. Where can I see my rest? Oh, I have two of these keys. We might be able to find more primos, yeah, for sure. Where do I see how many more I have? Definitely not these. And the map? A hundred. Oh, God. You know what? We can probably do those later. I kind of want to get into the main quest. Yeah, we can probably do all those like daily things later because the event's not ending anytime soon. So let's go and let's heal first. Yes, yeah, main quest time. Time to meet whoever Dane's line or Dine's left is. Deep is priceless. The happiness it brings lasts for only the moment it lives. <sighs> Are you planning to pull or save for everyone for anyone? I'm planning to pull. I always said I will always 10 pull whenever I can. I'm not really saving for anyone. I would love to have Arlequino, but Arlequino is not coming anytime soon. It's like maybe next month. So 
Um, yeah, I don't have the patience. <laughs> I have gathered everyone here today to make an important announcement. Perhaps some of you will have heard the news already. I am, in fact, planning to rebuild the Jade Chamber. Rebuild the Jade Chamber? That's a huge project! So the rumors are true. So the rumors the are true. Building materials has gone up Damn, so that's a deep voice. The Jade Chamber means a lot to Lady Ningguang. Getting involved in this would be a huge opportunity. Lady Ningguang, is there any way we can be of service? Patience. Since the news made it out a few days ago, I have already had many people contacting me to declare an interest in joining the project. I wonder if we're going to meet any, like, new bad guy. Nevertheless, I do have a few matters I should like to entrust to you here today. Or maybe we'll see Child again. The building site has been chosen, and most of the materials have been assembled. Three key- they are as follows. Sunset Vermilionite, Wonder Cores, and Adepti Sigils. Okay. Uh, excuse my ignorance, Lady Ningguang. I- I'm familiar enough with Plostrite, but I've never even heard of those other two. Only sufficiently large pieces of plostrite, or specifically, vermilionite, may earn themselves the sunset moniker. This stone is what allows the jade chamber to float. Wonder cores, meanwhile, are the central components of the mechanical structure this is like, of the jade chamber. It's like watching an anime with few chat. <laughs> adepti sigils serve as a means of integrating the mechanical devices with adepti art. They are as indispensable as the mechanical core itself. Although these three items are rare, I trust that with your connections and capabilities, Genshin watch along, yeah. Will not be a question of if, but of when. When of but of when? Okay. I take the saying, "Time is money," more seriously than most. Efficiency is everything. I will pay a generous price for the materials that you find, and in addition, the first three people who collect all the materials will have the opportunity to ask me a question. You may ask me anything, and I will give you an honest answer. I trust that this means of compensation will be to everyone's satisfaction. These things won't be easy to get hold of, but if it means a chance to get some inside information on Liuet Harbor's development plan for next year... Then it's the deal of a lifetime. Information from Lady Ningguang. Oh yeah, by the way, it is Xiao's when birthday. It first, it Was it or work. is it soon? <laughs> what a coincidence. I won't divulge too much, but I heard some murmurings about some plus strike just the other day. It so was. All, but, um, it was today. I have some business to oh my god, happy birthday, Xiao. <laughs> Let's go. It's our boy. Better move quickly, or this opportunity will be snatched away from us. Ningguang's rebuilding the Jade Chamber? This is wow. a huge deal! Let's yeah, that's go. that's probably gonna take many years. Thank you for the glizzy. Read his letter. Oh, so sure. You heard my announcement, did you? What do you think? Interested? Can I really ask you anything at all? Yes. Providing the question pertains to something I am knowledgeable about. Maybe I can find out about my sister. Really? Ooh, the primer will ask you about how to run a business! Then we'll never be short of Mora ever again! Ooh. <laughs> of course. But how much information I share with you will depend on your performance. The construction of the Jade Chamber requires a great deal of space. The abandoned mine outside the Golden House has been selected as the building site. Once you have collected the materials, please take them back. You know, it's actually crazy how, um, well, we've, we've been at it. We've been at Genshin Impact for like, for like a month now. I have other business to attend And it's kind of crazy how we're just I would almost there you the in Inazuma. Person. When you do arrive, please seek out my secretary. Remember, this is a race against the clock. A rare opportunity presents itself to you. 
Do not let somebody else snatch it from your grasp. Also, do I not have uh Come on, we better get going. There we go. There you go. First we gotta get out of Eugene Terrace. Uh, huh? Look! It seems like there's something kind of fishy going on over there. What is everybody's like favorite um remember no spoilers? But what is everybody's favorite nation? Is it nation? What you call it? Like region. You seem like an eminent and distinguished young lady to me. I can see that you're easily going to win this procurement contest, Lady Dingwang. Has Fontaine, done. wow. Sumeru. As it happens, we have some information about the materials that I really think might interest you. Come on, let's find somewhere a little more private. We can get down to Can't wait to visit tax. them, honestly. I can't wait to visit them. I'm excited. No. Who's I this? Ooh. Ah, uh, don't be like that. Hey, come on. Don't go. Why don't you stand there after her? Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. Definitely me not here. <laughs> the crane returns on the wind. Yes. I was gonna do something and I forgot. Just what, we need right now. what was I gonna do, chat? I forgot what I was gonna do, chat. So I guess I'm just gonna continue the quest. Um, we go this way. Oh, mail! Yeah, mail. Thank you for reminding me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, mail. There. Uh, which one is it? I think it's right here, right? Shao. In my dreams. Send their shell. Time date 2024 04, 17 at 1911. I've never liked dreaming. No matter what I see, I can neither control it nor easily escape. But recently, it's you that I keep seeing. All my dreams with you are of idle strolls and outings. Each time I awake, I can't help but wonder if I deserve to have such sweet dreams. Perhaps, were I to see you in the waking world... I would find the answer. If you're willing to meet me, just speak my name. Wow. Damn, Shao be rizzing you. Like, that's crazy. Shao has riz. Hannah May, thank you for the super, by the way. Hi, Lucy. Hope you're having an amazing day slash evening. Sending lots of love. I just wanted to let you know your streams always make me smile and laugh whenever I am down, just like today. Oh, I'm so sorry that you're down, Hannah. I'm so sorry, but I hope that you feel better, you know? Maybe watching the stream and uh, having a cool time with everyone here, the Lunarists and me, uh, will change it a little bit. But thank you. Thank you for the supa. Hope you feel better. But yeah, Shao? Shao is Riz. Where am I supposed to go? Hold on. Let me... Uh, I think it'll be faster if I... If I fly from here? No, actually... If I just keep going this way. Yep, yep. And then I go up here. I feel like I've been, yeah, definitely. Been, this is where I met child. I think. I believe. Maybe. Maybe I remember it wrong. <gasps> They're not here. Keep looking. Oh, there she is. Is that Dane Slave? She kind of cute, though. <laughs> well, will you look at that, ma'am? No, don't worry. We're not bad guys. You give us some Mora, we give you a little info. Everybody's a winner. <laughs> Brother, you look like a freaking NPC. Not even, not even NPC. You look like the NPC of the NPC, and you're trying to rob a character that looks like the MC. Like, brother. Boss, I got a bad feeling about this. Look at her, the, the white hair, the, the energy she gives off. I, I'm telling you, there, there's something different about her. Mmm. I like her eyes. So what? She's loaded. How are we ever going to repay those gambling debts if we just let money walk away from us, huh? I've already told you. I don't need your information. 
Damn, who's this character, bro? I like I like this character. What? If you still can't grasp that, I'm happy to repeat it in a way that won't Maybe be I do have a type. Get. Uh, come on, ma'am. You seem like an intelligent lady. I shouldn't have to spell this out to you. It's not about whether you need the info or not, okay? It's about you taking out your money and handing it over and nobody getting hurt. I won't... No more excuses! <sighs> I know you have money. I saw... Bro sounds so creepy. Hey, <laughs> I know you have money. Yeah, I saw you. Strolling into Leo Lee Pavilion, ordering a table full of food, and only taking a few bites. Then Shinyue Kiosk, then Wanmin Restaurant. Same story each time. You order all the signature dishes, take a few bites, then you're on your way again. How could you afford to be so wasteful if you weren't from a rich family? And since you're so rich, what's the loss to you in giving us a little spare change, huh? I am gonna guess uh, these kind of clothes are definitely from Inazuma and we are kind of being introduced to Inazuma characters because we are getting there eventually. Master warned me not to lay a hand on anyone. But maybe I'm wrong, maybe this is Liyue clothes. They could be very similar. But here we are. Maybe it's something else. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'm just dumb. Uh, yes. Let's call it Ooh. Hell yeah. Well, I'm telling you something's not right. It's Liyue? Okay. What are you afraid of? We're just selling information. It's not illegal. She lays a finger on us. They look a little better. different, though. They Similar definitely look a little different. There they are. Oh, you again. Millilith. What, what, what are the Millilith doing here? Did you do this? You ought to mind your own business. I swear. Silence. How dare you threaten innocent civilians? You're coming with us. <laughs> no, no. Don't, 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 don't be angry, sir. P p p please, let me explain. The Millilith takes away the hooligans who are surrounding the young lady with the white hair. <sighs> are you alright? Shenha. Shenha? Sh Shenha? Shenha? My name. Oh, so your name's Shenha! Paimon's name is. Well, Paimon! And this is Paimon's travel buddy! Lucian! Oh, I've heard about you two before. <sighs> Thank you for helping to defuse the situation. Uh, I could have dealt with it myself, though. <sighs> I suspect smashing his head against the ground a handful of times is all it would have taken to get him to surrender. The eyes are really nice looking, though. <gasps> you, you can't do that. That's way too violent. This is Lila Harbor. There are laws against that kind of stuff, you know. Laws? Have you not heard of the law, Shenha? Shenha? No, apparently not. Really? So how exactly have you? Hmm. What was that noise? That would be my stomach growling. Hmm. I haven't eaten enough. She's so honest. Wait, that's right. They said you went around all the restaurants ordering this and that and the other, but only took a small bite of each dish. It's because she got no money. Then of course you're still hungry. So, anything in particular you're hungry for? Hmm. Chingson, glaze lily, violet grass. These are my usuals. Oh. Those are all medical herbs. Hmm. Medicinal herbs? Oh, medicinal. I, <laughs> I read that wrong. Not far away. Let's take Shenha there for a big medicinal meal. Medicinal meal, After okay. All, you can't work on an empty stomach. So I guess now we're getting food. I guess we are getting food for her. Are we gonna meet Chi Chi again? And that guy, I forgot his name, the green hair guy. No, what? Are you here to buy some herbs? I do hope you brought your prescription. Chingsen, glaze lily, and violet grass, please. 
Half a pound of each. Baiju, yeah. What kind of prescription is this? Sounds more like a lunch order. <laughs> oh, here you go. That's everything we have in stock. Thank you. She's really eating them! To everyone's astonishment, Sean had plushes, whatever, I can't read. My hunger has now abated. Thank you. How did they taste? Rather awful. Though they were not completely devoid of sweet fragrance, after consuming a large quantity of them, bitterness is all that remains. So, how can you chow down on these and barely touch the restaurant food? If Paimon had enough, Mora, Paimon would go to the fanciest restaurant in town and order a whole table of food and eat it all in one go! Because I'm not sure whether I will remain here in the future. Eh? The food of the mortal realm is most delicious, but should I return to the mountains, yearning for Wait, what? here shall only pose an obstacle to my continued spiritual development. Eh? What is she? Sampling each dish in order to appreciate its taste is enough. Is she an adept eye? Return to the mountains. That proves it. Paimon knew she was an adeptus. Adeptus. Yeah, there. Enough about me. What are your plans? But how come we're just meeting her now and not during the attack? Oh, right! Paimon almost forgot! We came out to take part in the Rebuild the Jade Chamber competition! And... And now we're probably super behind because we've been held up for so long. Hmm, I see. I heard something about the contest when I was passing by. <laughs> yep! You get to ask Ningguang any question you want if you win! Were you interested in the contest too, Shenha? Hmm. I came for the rebuilding of the Jade Chamber. Oh, Until this point, okay. I have no intention of joining a contest. So basically, she knows Ningguang. However, you have shown me your kindness, and I would now like to lend you my assistance. Oh, don't worry. I ask for nothing in return. Wow! You really don't have to. But having an adeptus help out will make things a whole lot easier, so... Sure. Let's join forces. Then let's not delay. I have a plan. She has a plan. Great! Paimon bets this is gonna be the awesomest plan ever! Mm, I am not sure whether or to what extent this plan can be classified as awesome. I do, however, believe it will be highly effective. We simply need to dispose of everyone who is currently ahead of us. Huh? Then... We alone shall become the victors. Me? Mito! That is not <laughs> Not by a long shot. <laughs> she just wants to smack everyone's head on the floor. Really? But I hear that competition is in essence about conflict and one-upmanship. Look, we want to win this competition fair and square, okay? It's Sunset Vermilion Night, Wonder Chorus, and Adepti Sigils. Let's start at the top of the list and work down. So, for Plastrite... I was wondering who I could oh, be Baiju. arguing over there. Maybe Chi Chi's there so, too? it's you. Baiju? What are you doing out here? Lady Ningguang wishes to purchase a large batch of wound dressing. We're running low at the store, so I came out to fetch the ingredients personally. Huh? How can Lady Ningguang need so much wound dressing all of a sudden? I'm not too sure. I did hear she's looking to rebuild the Jade Chamber. Maybe for its first aid on site? I didn't ask, though. Far be it from me to pry into my customer's personal affairs. Oh, and she also borrowed Chi-Chi. <laughs> Meaning Boo Boo Pharmacy is very short-handed right now. She I borrowed don't Chi-Chi. any of you are looking for part-time work by any chance? We've got other stuff to do. Um, while you're here, though, you seem to know a lot. Have you ever heard of something called Sunset Vermilionite? Ah, the variety of plostrite used in the Jade Chamber, yes? There is some mention of it in the Seven Mountain Treatises. When activated, Sunset Vermilionite rises up all the way into the clouds. It's very rare indeed. 
As far as the records show, virtually all Sunset Vermilionite in existence has been mined and taken possession of. But the Feiyun Commerce Guild would know far more about this than I do. Ah, uh, okay. Okay then, let's go ask at the Feiyun So it's basically like a monopoly. They have all of it, right? There's no way we can find... We can find them in the wild. Thanks, Feiyun! You're quite welcome. Good I feel like his voice changed. And if there's anything further you need from me, or maybe the way he speaks. The I do not remember him sounding like that. And it was just like, like two streams ago, I believe. No, actually like a stream. Yeah, like two streams ago. It did sound like that. He sounds a little more, like he has a little more character to it. That's the way he speaks. Interesting. I don't know. Maybe it's just because it's been like two weeks since I heard him. Like, he doesn't sound like an extra character that we just met. He kind of sounds like a character that, you know, will be recurring. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I know it came out in a different version, so it definitely feels it was a little different. A little. Master Singcho, thank goodness you're finally back. Oh. This is the first time we meet this guy. Here, at least, right? Oh? Why do I detect an urgency in your voice? The guild has had a whole string of strange orders in recently. Everyone's been completely caught off guard. Your father gave me specific instructions to ask you to stay and help out if I happen to see you. I see. Have someone sort the orders by type for now. I'll deal with them myself shortly. Oh, how wonderful. Thank you, Master. With you on the job, I can breathe a sigh of relief. Hey, Shinchu! Glad you're here. What? <laughs> Did I miss something? How do I know this guy already? I'm just gonna assume I know him. We want to ask you for some information. Traveler, Paimon. Please wait a moment. Okay. Shu, I need to entertain some guests. Please continue with your work for the time being, and we'll discuss the matter of the guild's orders in more detail later on. Understood, Master Singchio. Then I will leave you in peace. You're right, he does sound like child. He does sound like him. I wasn't counting on finding you here today. What's going on? And how, pray tell, may I be of service? Shinchu, have you ever heard of Sunset? Vermilionite? Oh, I see. So you've entered Lady Ningguang's contest as well. As well? Do you mean... The truth is, the Feiyun Commerce Guild is in possession of some Sunset Vermilionite, but only one piece. We are holding it on behalf of someone who has asked us to put it up for auction, and a lot of interested parties have already come to us inquiring about the price. At the end of the day, it all comes down to supply and demand. In this case, I'm guessing the final transaction price may be in excess of 500 million mora. 500 million mora? 500 million? That's so expensive. Honestly, I would recommend that you don't bother bidding on this one. The price is greatly inflated, and it's just not worth it. But without any sunset vermilionite... Don't panic. I don't suppose you ever heard of Seagazer? Who? Never heard of him. Hmm. Seagazer was once very close to Mountain Shaper, but if I am not mistaken, he has already passed away. Yes, precisely. I didn't know anyone else knew about him. According to records of drifting clouds, Seagazer once built an abode to store his rarest and most exquisite treasures, among which was some sunset vermilionite. After Seagazer passed, the abode was abandoned, and its location was lost to time. Luckily, I came into possession of a stack of folk history books just recently. They make some oblique references to this lost abode, and after cross-referencing them against each other, I'm now fairly certain that it is situated in the Leisha area. Ooh, it's so good. maybe we will be able to find some vermilionites. Really okay yes, it is, Paimon. It's ours. It be a little, you know, disrespectful with him no. being an adeptus? You needn't worry. As far as I understand, Seagazer was very open-minded. Even while he was alive, he wouldn't have let something like this bother him. 
Open-minded. I have not heard of Seagazer being described in this way before. May I ask where you read that? Just a rumor I heard out in the mountains. Ah, oh, she can't tell him. All right then, let's go. Interesting. Hmm. There's something about this young lady that reminds me of a good friend of mine. Good friend of his. I am definitely missing some lore. Oh, I almost forgot. Adepti abodes tend to have very ingenious designs, especially when it comes to their defense mechanisms. Plus, Wait. it's likely to be crawling with monsters after being abandoned for so long. So please, be very careful. Okay, we will be. Thanks, I'm gonna... Ah, oh, man. This is gonna be a whole plot twist. This is gonna be a whole plot twist, isn't it? Why is it always that one character? Where do we go? We gotta go here. It's the same, like, it's the same Zhongli thing. Probably the, the, the character that's supposedly dead, the uh, Seagazer, is, is Shan Shenha. He's a knower. Hmm. This place was hidden using a special Adepti art. But now that I have removed it, we can inspect the area more closely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop capping. I already know. Wow, that's amazing. Yep, let's take another look around. Hey, look. Is that a new ceiling over there? Oh. Ooh, what was that? The ceiling got to here and then disappear. Should we? Oh, very interesting. I don't have a nice character right now, so uh, it's lower than recommended. It's fine. I'm pretty strong, I believe. Abode of that adeptus. With any luck, the sunset vermilionite we're looking for should be in here. Really? Let Paimon see! Huh? Isn't that the ceiling from before? Look, it's gone and snuck beneath the clouds! And now that Paimon takes a closer look, the rocks and trees here don't seem complete. Oh, could there be something below the clouds? What do you think, Shinha? These are not real clouds. They are the product of an Adepti art used for spatial partitioning. How do you know? If we want to go down, we must first destroy the mechanism that is maintaining the Adepti art. All right, then let's do it. I love how they just don't question Shinha. I sense the presence of monsters in this place. I don't know where they are hiding, so we'd better be careful. They, they, they don't Ooh, god damn i get to play with her she oh, she's an ice character wow she has two dashes she's like shao but better Look at this. Nah, no, she's cool. She's cool. She's pretty cool. Damn. When is she coming back? When is she coming back? Oh. Oh. Manifest. 
Ooh, she's pretty strong. I can't wait to see her ulti. Is she a five star, by the way? Yes. Oh, that's so cool. She's limited too. Limited. What does that mean? I can't get there. Isn't that a chest? I believe that was a chest, no? <laughs> oh, it is. Nice. Then we get this thing here. She looks really fun to play, to be honest. How do I get there? I guess I'm just gonna kill these because I wanna. Oh, that's so cool, though. I love characters that can dash. I just really love characters that can dash. It's like my favorite type of characters. And she's cute, too? Anything? No, okay. It appears that we've been taken for intruders. This time, why not allow me to take care of this? Let the mighty be humble. Hmm. Bow your head. Oh, that's interesting. I can charge it too. I thought, oh. Do your master's bidding. Wait, that's actually so cool, though. It's not just a dash, but it's also, it's also another ability. It's basically like having more than just one ability. I can do that and I can also just dash. It looks like we need to go further down. But before that, let's destroy the guard mechanisms on this level first. Take your true form! Is that guy alive? I think that guy might be alive. Not yet, but he will. Wait, what? Oh, I guess it's because I didn't hit anyone with it. Okay, it makes sense. What if I do this, though? Oh, there you go. But only once. Oh, what the? What is that big guy doing here? Nice. Ooh, honestly, having Shenha would be really cool on my team. That is so broken. The fact that he just freezes all the time because of the... Oh, that's actually insane. 
No, that's actually insane. And then me constantly just hitting him. Oh, God. Wait, I need a heal. There we go. That thing is going to wake up soon. There you go. You can break shields with Geo. Yeah. I didn't need it. I didn't need it. There's no need for it. We're going to fall. This time we're going to fall. I can't really do anything here, so. She just falls in the water. Oh, the chest. I really like this character, though. Oh, it's a puzzle. Or not really, I guess. <laughs> Never mind, it is a puzzle. No, maybe not. It's just... Yeah, it's just there. <laughs> it's just an obstacle. What? Bro. That also, that freezes too, which is pretty cool. Nice. I probably shouldn't have used that. Or maybe it's fine. Come over here. Yeah. So the combo between Shenha and this guy is actually pretty strong. Because I can just freeze him every time I hydro cannon. So if I use this and then this guy. Oh, never mind. Oh, Jesus, that hurts. What am I actually killing here? Is there another monster? Oh no, never mind. It's just the same thing. It's just a different monster and the other health bar is the middle thingy. Yeah. Take your true form. Submit. Give up. Eat this. My will and Okay, suddenly I maybe don't do that much damage. <laughs> Rain outlines your fate. No, my sword. Let the mighty be humble. There we go. Let's uh let's put this here. Go to number five. Take your true form. My will and, and there we go. Ooh, just in time. Just in time to freeze them both. Woo! Let's go. That's just insanely strong. Hmm. 
There we go. That took a little bit. For being... For this being like a filler episode... It kinda is a long quest. Oh, we gotta get up there. Maybe it is. We're about to find out by following this little guy. The music is really nice though. Ooh, there's a table here. Reminds me of the one that... Oh. <laughs> it reminds me of the one where you, uh, where we had to feed or give, like, food offering to the Adeptus. <gasps> oh, it's green. I would thought the Vermilionite was red or, or maybe, like, Is this the Scarlet. So is the Jade Chamber, but it makes sense though. That's true, but then again, why isn't it floating? Pawstrate doesn't float until it's activated. It may look different from most ordinary stones, but it weighs around the same amount. Only after being activated does Pawstrate reveal its true nature, breaking free from the shackles of the mortal realm and ascending up into the heavens. Wow, Shenha. You seem to know everything about this. Only because my master is fond of chatting about these things. The moment she has some time to spare, she'll come straight for me and start telling story after story. I don't care for her stories most of the time. I certainly didn't expect them to ever come in handy like this. I wonder who this master is. Hold on a sec. Paimon just realized something. If we activate it here, there's no way we'll be able to get it back to the site, right? Heck, we'll be dragged up into the sky too! But if we don't activate it, how else are we gonna lift it? This rock must weigh well over a thousand pounds, surely! Don't worry, I can handle the weight quite easily. Uh? Are you sure? Eh? Uh, be careful! Please don't worry. I'm well aware that a Plostrite sample this large must be highly valuable. I will be gentle with it and make sure it does not get damaged. Paimon meant you, Shenha. My safety. That's right! Paimon's sure you can handle it and everything. But if something this heavy lands on you, you're gonna get yourself hurt! How strong is she really? Oh, I just realized this is the vision, right? This is the uh, cryo vision. Right? Objects. It's just common sense. I didn't see it before. Is it now? Hm. Well then, thank you. I'll go on ahead with the plostrite. Let's meet at the building site later. Wow. <laughs> Alrighty. We're done here. Hold on, before I go there, I have to... There's like a uh, waypoint that I can unlock here. I haven't been here at all. Can you stand up, please? You're, I knew you are a little too tall, but, you know, it's not that hard to stand up. Thank you. Oh, it's a little birdie. Bum ba dum ba dum bum bum bum. There we go. Now we can come back here anytime. Easy peasy. Um, let's teleport here. Dude's a water dragon, not a mountain goat. Must be quite an inconvenience for you. True, true, I guess. Ooh, 
That was lightning. I saw that lightning literally next to me. Wow! Shanghai really did some work. And off we go. Look, this looks so cool. Oh my god, I can't believe my eyes. Oh my god, I can't believe my eyes. <laughs> the way he said it. Oh my god. <laughs> How can she lift that massive rock all by herself? She's got to be one of those adepti, surely. Oh, mighty adeptus, please give me your blessing so that in the coming year I may reap a more bountiful salary. This is top tier in size and quality, and the condition it's in is quite simply immaculate. I'm going to award you full marks for the Sunset Vermilionite item. May I take your name? My name isn't important. I'm not even here to compete. I was just delivering this for some other people. They should be here any minute now. Yeah, I'm flying. Oh, there you go. I'm, I'm right here. Yep. Mm -hmm. I just fell from the sky. Ah, so you're the ones behind this. No wonder. The rarest talent turns in the rarest plostrite specimen. But I have to correct you on one point. It's not helper. It's secretary. Secretary. Yes, I just started the Shen, uh, Shen Ha quest like 20 minutes ago. Then after this, we're going to dance life quest. <laughs> okay then, Miss Secretary. What do you think of the rock we found? Pretty amazing, right? In truth... It is the finest piece of plostrite we have received so far. If everything goes according to plan, we will use this piece in the foundation of the Jade Chamber, which will enable us to proceed to the next stage of construction. As a side note, Lady Ningguang has rented some dwellings in the nearby area to serve as accommodations for the contestants. If you need a place to rest, you are welcome to stay there. Now, please excuse me. As you can see, there is still a lot of work to do on the building site. Shenhua! Shenhua! Just now on the way over, pretty much everyone was singing your praises! Oh, really? Oh, what kind of really? What is that? So strange. Aren't you happy about it? Whenever Paimon gets praised, Paimon can't help but hold their head up high and break into a big smug smile! I've had similar compliments before. Damn! They call me an adeptus. Treat me with great deference and respect, as if I'm set apart from the common folk. Yeah, cause that's how adept I are. At least the ones we've met are pretty unique and reclusive too. Way different than normal people. But uh, I am not... Wait, what? Shanna? Are you alright? I'm fine. I've been exerting myself quite a lot ever Who since is she exactly? Uh, I'm just a little fatigued. Um, well, Byron said that there are some makeshift hotels we can use, right? Let's go check in and take a rest. No need. I simply need to find myself a secluded place in the wilderness to sit and meditate in silence. She's definitely weird. Oh my god, imagine the lightning just strikes her right now. That'd be so funny. Go eat something tasty, and when you're tired, you go lie down in a nice, comfy bed. Paimon is right. Okay, if you insist. Great! Now we're talking. Let's head to our hotel. We have a hotel? I thought we just slept in the Statue of the Seven. That's crazy. I've never seen my hotel. Chad, did you know the chances of getting lightning striked are those of one in a million chances? So if you get struck by a lightning, that is very unlucky. It's either you're very unlucky or you are very lucky. Checking in, are we? 
You're just in time. We only have two rooms left. In game or IRL, <laughs> IRL. <laughs> Since this was chosen, and the chances of living are also one in a million. We've had a constant <laughs> stream of people in this area, and not just workers either. Visitors, business people, tea sellers, all sorts. So, business is booming for me today. Very few vacancies. You're lucky you got here when you did. Oh yeah. Great. One of your rooms is still being cleaned. I, I guess it should be ready within the hour. The other room is just at the door on the left. Here are your keys. All right. Hope you enjoy your stay. Please excuse me. I'll leave you to it. Sure, huh? You should go get some rest. We'll hang around outside until the other room's ready. Hyman's gonna go see if there's anything good to eat around here. <laughs> Hyman couldn't help but notice one of the guests walk in with a huge... Huge grilled chicken drumstick before. Damn. What are you going to do with that? Let's buy one for Shenhua too. She can have it as a midnight snack. Or save it for breakfast tomorrow. <sighs> All right. I will head to my room for now. I am curious as to who you are, Shenhua. If you need anything, don't hesitate to disturb me. I'm a light sleeper. I will hear if you knock on the door. Have a good rest, Shenhua. Mm-hmm. See you tomorrow. What's she doing here? Hmm. Let's go and say hi. Could it be? One trusts you have met Shen He. So, are you getting along quite well? So far, so good. Yeah. So, you know Shen He too, Cloud Retainer? Naturally. Save for Ganyu, who spends the majority of her time in Liyue Harbor. All the Adepti living today are acquainted with Shen He to some degree. Shen He. Cool. So, what's her Adeptus name anyway? Calling her Shenhua feels kind of friendly, but also kind of disrespectful. So Paimon's thinking maybe it'd be better if we called her by her Adeptus name instead. Her Adeptus name? Why, pray tell, would Shenhua have an Adeptus name? So she's not an Adeptus. Uh, don't all Adepti have a special title they go by? On this latter point, you are correct. However, oh? Shenhua is human. She's a human. Oh, oh, right. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? Never would have guessed. Neither. This is a real surprise. Do you mean to say that she presents differently from ordinary human beings? Well, to start with, her problem-solving methods are extremely direct. Ah, oh, yes. She was like this all those years ago when one first met her. In this respect, she has not changed. Interesting. Maybe she was... I don't know. One first found Shanha by chance in a cave. One was passing by and sensed the presence of a god's remains. Being of an ever-vigilant disposition, one entered immediately to inspect the scene. Inside was Shanha. Then aged around she was raised by a in her head, She held a dagger with which she was confronting a monster that was the god's remains incarnate. What? It sounds so dangerous. When one arrived, she had already been locked in confrontation with this monster for several days. Most mortal children are fragile, both physically and mentally and are highly reliant on their parents for survival. But not so her. That she was able to endure such terrible danger was due not only to her strong willpower, but also to the bloodlust and homicidal instinct with which she was born. 
One dealt with the monster, that still doesn't tell me who she, she is. she still refused to lower her guard. She even pointed her dagger in one's direction and remained ready to strike. Only after she was satisfied that one had no intention to cause her harm did she finally relent. She then passed out without uttering a single word. In other words, if you hadn't passed by that day, Shenhe might have... Shenhe. Not necessarily. Upon one's arrival, one could sense that the god's wrath was gradually receding. Even had the stalemate continued, one suspects that Shen He may have still emerged the victor of the confrontation. Mm -hmm. That's still so dangerous, though. Why was a tiny little kid battling against the wrath of a god in the first place? <laughs> the wrath of a god in the first place! Alas, the <laughs> mortal world is rife with suffering of every kind. And she had experienced her fair share of this, even at a tender age. Seeing that she was homeless, one decided to adopt her. Okay, yeah, so she has been raised by Adeptus. So when Shenha talks about her master, she means... Indeed, it is one to whom she refers. Cloud Retainer. Shenha has an extraordinary constitution, making her well adapted to practicing the Adepti arts. All the Adepti cherished her talents, and so we were willing to train her. However, her homicidal urges did not subside with Homicidal age. urges? Rather, they grew stronger day by day. Mooncarver once performed a divination for her. He declared that her fate is to bear the curse of calamity. Consumed by malevolent energy. She is prone to bring harm to those around her. Such is the magnitude of the danger this poses, that her soul must be bound with red ropes to keep her homicidal instinct at bay. The red ropes have indeed served to keep her calmer and more content. They also seem to have rendered her somewhat inexpressive. Perhaps the red ropes are so powerful that they have suppressed some of her other emotions as well. Interesting. She leaving? It is only by fate that people's paths may cross. Now that Shen He's path has crossed with yours, please be sure to treasure the gift that fate has given you and take good care of her. Oh, now Paimon gets it. You came out here to check up on Shenhe because you were worried about her, didn't you? Huh. You dare draw such a facile conclusion on the nature of one's present excursion. <laughs> Incorrect. The truth is that while Liyue Harbor may seem peaceful today, danger is always lurking in the shadows. Ningguang once made a bold assertion that this is to be the era of the contract between Liyue and the humans. Well, one is most curious to observe how she will respond to the coming storm. If she handles it admirably, one is willing to be a witness to her achievements. But if she does not, the Adepti shall not hesitate to seize control. Let us conclude our conversation here for today. One has occupied enough of your time, and night is approaching. Be sure to get ample rest. Nice. Okay, so we got a little backstory on her. She's not. Wait until the following day, 8 a.m. Let's do 8.01. That's interesting. Um, hey! So, Shenhe... Master has relayed my situation to you, I take it. Oh? How did you know? She was listening. I'd intended to wait until you came back before going to sleep, but I didn't hear you come in. I was worried that something may have happened to you, 
so I went outside to check and caught sight of my master. Yeah, she was just eavesdropping. On top of this, you have been acting very strangely around me this morning, causing me to suspect that my master must have told you everything about me. After all, master is... very talkative. <laughs> Sorry, Shenhua. Paimon had you down as an adeptus this whole time, but it turns out Paimon was wrong. It's okay. I don't mind. Damn, Fault she's aggressive. For not explaining everything to you sooner, because in my experience, trying to explain is a futile pursuit. Still, though you mistook me for an adeptus, you never treated me as distant and unapproachable. Instead, you treated me as you would a friend. For this, I am very grateful indeed. Oh. To be fair, we've met our fair share of real adepti too. Anyway, now it's settled. From now on, you're our friend. Whether you're an adeptus or a human isn't the important thing. First and foremost, we're just plain old friends. Got it. Although I don't know quite what it entails in terms of what I have to do, I must say I like the title friend very much indeed. Great! Well, now that we're all rested up, we should start searching for the other two items on the list. But before we do that, Let's go to the building site and ask Ningguang's little helper how the progress is going. After all, Sunset Vermilionite is so rare. Paimon doubts many competitors will really be able to find any. If it turns out some of them have given up already, we'll be able to take things a little more slowly. <laughs> Either, yeah, he's just <laughs> sitting there. Oh, this quest is long. He's just standing in there. Here's one for you, Shenhua. Try it. I feel like Paimon has said Shen Shenhua's name three times differently throughout this whole quest. Far more agreeable than I'm not even joking. In the in the I'm not even trying to be funny. First she call her Shenhe, then Shenhua, and then Shenhua. something that's because it's not finished hey Paimon and hey um people Paimon doesn't know oh given the enormous scale of the jade chamber we split the construction work into two phases to make sure the structure remains balanced before we find some suitable plostrite we build the jade chamber's keel at ground level once the plostrite is ready, we place it into the keel and let the partially constructed jade chamber rise up to the height of the surrounding mountain peaks. The remainder of the construction work is then carried out at that altitude. Once everything is ready, we release the iron tethers and allow the jade chamber to rise to its target altitude. I wonder when was the last time they made a jade chamber? You know, like how long ago was it really? Miss Bywin, we brought some new materials to submit. One moment, I'll be right there. The construction work has only been able to progress this rapidly thanks to the plostrite provided by you. Lady Ningguang is most grateful and looks forward to seeing more of your work. Do you have a new blood signature weapon, Lucy? I don't, actually. I am using prototype amber, I believe. Wow, can't believe you sourced the plostrite so quickly. It's the key piece of the puzzle. Looks like you beat us to the punch. Damn, she's, yeah, she's a yapper. Wait, I know you. You're the one who fought against the Fatui and Osile, right? Oh, sure enough, your reputation precedes you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Beto. Captain Beto! Beto? Are you here to join the Jade Chamber Contest too? <laughs> sure am. I happen to get my hands on a chunk brum, of sun. Brum, brum, Even though it's rare, we're not the oh, I've got some oh, I skipped it by here. accident. This is that was loud, Yun wasn't it? Or Yunjin, probably the most welcome, welcome to the, the city. <laughs> Greetings. These two are Paimon and the Traveler. I'm sure you've heard of them before. And this is... Uh, sorry, I'm not sure we've met. Shenhua. I am there. Mm. 
friend. <laughs> Good to meet you. Well, from today on, I guess all of us are friends. Miss Yoon is also here for the contest. Turns out she needed to borrow a boat, so we came together. It's an honor to finally meet you both. I've heard much about you. Yeah, I have you as a character. We are only meeting for the first time. I have a feeling that we will get along very well indeed. To be honest with you all, I am in great need of this opportunity to ask Lady Ningguang a question. That's why I joined the contest. Thanks to my father's connections, I was able to acquire a specimen of the plostrite required. Fortunately, it was approved for submission, despite being a little on the diminutive side. Wow! So it looks like the three of us are competitors now! Excuse me for prying, Miss Shenhe, but are you competing as well? No, I don't have any questions for Ningguang. I just wanted to help him win. In that case, I have a proposal to make. Ooh, team up? Lady Ningguang said that the first three contestants to procure all three materials will be awarded the chance to ask a question. Well, there are three teams here. We can split the prize between us. Instead of competing against each other, we could work together to secure the top three places between us. What do you think? Sounds great, but how does it change things exactly? <laughs> <laughs> I think I see where you're going with this, Miss Yoon. The plostrite was the most difficult item to source by a long shot. Luckily, all three of us managed to get our hands on it. The two remaining items aren't quite so rare, so as long as one of us finds a way to source it, the other two can hop on the bandwagon. How'd I do? Is that what you had in mind? Precisely. She sounds so confident, too. Huh. Interesting approach. Okay, then. All right. I'll go first. I have some leads on these wonder cores. From what I've heard, the core itself is really not that difficult to make. The hard part is getting hold of the ore used as raw materials. I'm gonna head back to the ship and ask Su Ling if he's heard of them. You guys... Who's your favorite character? Uh, Xiao. So far. We will head into town and seek advice from Master Zhang of Hanfeng's Ironmongers. Thoughts? Sounds good. Let's go. Wonderful. We'll split into teams then, and whoever makes progress first brings all of us a step closer to victory. I'm gonna take off. See you later. Okay, let's go! By the way, what question are you gonna ask Ningguang Yunjin? I'm looking for a venue to host the performance of our new opera. Lady Ningguang has excellent judgment, so I would like to hear her opinion. Ooh, what's Ooh. the opera called? Paima wants to go see it! The opera is a labor of love by my father. He wrote it based on a popular urban legend about an evil spirit and an adeptus. Uh? It's called The Divine Damsel of Devastation. Interesting. Um, now we go back to the teleport waypoints. <gasps> We're gonna talk to Abyssos. Oh, never mind. Hey, Catherine. Master Zhang. Hmm? Ah, hello. Are you here ah, to hello. Yourself, or do you need something forged? You need something forged. Excuse me, Master Zhang. We were wondering if you'd heard of something called a Wonder Core. Of course I have. Sorry, um, who's asking? My name is Yunjin. Perhaps you don't know me, but I believe that you forged some weaponry for my father in the past for stage use. Yunjin? Stage use? Oh, so <clears throat> you must be Miss Yun. <clears throat> Sorry. My brain's finally caught up. Uh, it's not used to doing much beyond bashing a hammer all day. <laughs> Everyone's heard of you, Miss Yoon. Even folks She's quite popular, know isn't she? That often. <laughs> like myself. So, you're here to ask about wonder cores, huh? As it happens, I do know how to make them. Matter of fact, I made some for Lady Ningguang back when she was building the original Jade Chamber. Oh, uh, wait. 
So it wasn't that long ago, I believe, then, right? The first uh, Jade Chamber. The types of ore needed to make Wonder Core because this guy is just a human. Lady Ningguang supplied them herself last time. It probably hasn't I been like 30 years. Brought any yourselves? Maybe like around 20 to 30 years ago. No, we were gonna ask you what kinds of ore we need. <laughs> sure. Well, you'll need two kinds: Star Splinter Iron and Sabrosium. If I remember correctly, Lady Ningguang sourced her Star Splinter Iron from the Mount Tianhung area. They say it resonates with visions. It could take some work, but if you stick with it, you'll find some eventually. As for the Sabrosium, though, hmm, that's trickier. It's all but unheard of on the market. Then where do we start? Uh, I'm really not sure. Sorry. What I've heard is that the people around Mount Tianhung have some sort of magic trick that can pinpoint the location of the stuff. Of course, it's probably just hearsay. If you want my advice, start by looking for Star Splinter Iron around Mount Tianhung. And if you run into any locals, ask them a few questions about Sabrosium. Mount Tianhung. Interestingly enough, the story of the Divine Damsel of Devastation also takes place on that mountain. Oh. I hear the view there is quite spectacular. A favorite destination of the Adepti, in fact. It feels like everything just probably goes around, you know, it goes around. Uh, I believe the the Oprah thing is about Shenha and the Adepti. They're kind of like pointing at it, like maybe it's that. See, we're going back to that place. I came to Mount Tianung once with my father as a child. I remember it being such a long climb that I could. Maybe she's gonna get some flashbacks. By the time we reached the top. <laughs> this is quite a trip down memory lane for me. Look at these majestic towering peaks. It's very beautiful the though. Gently flowing streams. It's like setting foot in paradise. No wonder the legend of the divine damsel of devastation is said to have taken place here. Adepti wander oft where mortals seldom stride. Indeed, this looks like a place that one might expect to be frequented by Adepti. The Divine Damsel of Devastation is your upcoming opera, right? And the story takes place in Mount Tianhung. Huh. Seems like you have a real connection with this place. What's the story about, though? It's the story of a girl becoming a hero. Cool. A hero story? They're Paimon's favorite! The legend first arose in this area. It is said that there used to be a prosperous village on the mountain. In that village, there was a loving couple who were completely devoted to one another. One day, a terrifying monster appeared. I wonder what kind of... really wonder what kind of monster that is. The wife was out collecting herbs and was captured by the monster. Her husband was so distraught at the news that it broke his spirit and drove him to madness. The vile and vicious monster told the villagers, If you want to live, you must sacrifice a child to me. <gasps> no. What a nasty piece of work. Ugh. Paimon sure hopes this monster gets put in its place. But the monster was so terrible and so strong that all within the village were terrified of it. They had no choice but to give in to the monster's demand. <gasps> no. Just while they were discussing whose child would be given over to the monster, a little girl suddenly stood up and came forward. Okay, so I thought it was going to be her parents. So it's not her parents. No! Don't do it, little girl! <laughs> Unbeknownst to anybody else, she was concealing an exorcist's blade. She approached the monster's lair, feigning fear and trepidation. When she finally arrived, she courageously drew her sword and entered into a fierce struggle with the monster, from which she eventually emerged as the victor. Her extraordinary abilities drew the attention of the Adepti, and they took her as one of their own. Oh. Her story became the stuff of legends. But alas, 
the paths of mortals and adepti seldom cross, and she would never again re-enter the mortal world. And so, destined to grace the mortal realm for but a brief moment, Look at she managed to put a wisp of smoke into thin air. <laughs> That's how the opera ends. I really like this story. <laughs> but I personally think that perhaps the little girl was... <sighs> Not as brave as the opera makes her out to be. I'm not sure she deserves all the praise she is given. Ah, stop. Hmm, I've never considered that before. Opera is always an interpretation of the events it purports to portray. A certain degree of deviation from the truth is always inevitable. When my father wrote the script for this play, I suppose his intention was to inspire his audience. With the character of the Divine Damsel. Hmm. I think it's a great story. The ideal story. Well, it sure inspired Paimon! Let's go get ourselves some Star Splinter Iron! Yeah, yeah, Paimon, break the ice! Let's just not talk about this awkward situation. Thank you. So, um... Is it this? How do I do this again? Where do I go with this? <laughs> Maybe it's this? That's a Geo Sigil. I don't know what that is for, though, to be honest. Oh. Oh, that was fast. How many do I need? I didn't even... Oh. That actually kind of looks like... Uh, what's it called again? The... The rock that looks like that? So I, I would have never we thought it was that. village on our way here. Master Jong said we should ask the locals for help. Why don't we try there? Core Lapis. Hey, yeah, Core Lapis. Here. Thank you, thank you. Yunjin, looks like you were right. Excuse us, sir. Can we ask you something? <gasps> uh. Huh. He didn't seem to catch that. Hello, sir. We were just passing by, and wanted to ask if you happen to know anything about Sabrosium. <gasps> Is he trying to tell us to look for clues in the He's village? a zombie. Well, whatever. Guess we're on our own here. Shenhua, Yunjin, let's have a look around. Sorry, you can go ahead without me. I'd like to have a word with this gentleman. Ah, uh, she's gonna break his head. <laughs> if that's okay with you, Uncle Mingjin. Uncle? It's... It... Shen He. Shen He. You're alive. The rumors were true. So, all these years? I'm sorry, I don't know how to find Sabrosium. But I think you can find some information in the village. This place is deserted now. No one ever comes here. So you can rummage around all you want. Huh? He sounds you like... Know this guy, He's got no emotions left. Uh... Thank you, kind sir. We'll go and take a look around. Don't worry. Mingjin has no ill intention towards Miss Shenhe. She'll be quite safe. How does she know that? find in this village <laughs> huh. what's this the doctor said you were gravely ill don't worry I will give everything I have to save you my heart bleeds whenever I see you getting wearier. Your illness beyond treatment. How I wish I could suffer the pain for you. 
You said you had no regrets in this life, and that you only wish for me to take good care of Shen Ha. But if you regret nothing, why the tears? I don't know what I've been doing lately, though I still breathe. I feel like an empty shell. I have read all the ancient texts I could get my hands on, looking for ways to save you, but it is utterly futile. I finally found it. It was Ming Jung. He had kept the book that could save you hidden. I took it and followed its instructions to summon a god and offer a sacrifice. The god appeared. I told him that I was willing to exchange my life for yours. He kept silent and only pointed at our daughter, Shen Ha. The god said her fate was to bear the curse of calamity and that she was prone to bring harm to those close to her. The god also said that she might even have been the cause of your death. In that case, I thought I should. I left her in the cave that the god mentioned. Three days have passed, and still no news. I grow restless from waiting. Seized by an ominous feeling. I am sorry, my love. Forgive me. You too, Shen He. Please, forgive me. How stupid I was. How blind. Let me apologize to both of you and person. Maybe this is the true story of the Divine Dem Self Devastation. So, Shen He is the Divine Damsel? Now that I think about it, she does behave rather like an adeptus, and she is about the right age. So that's why I've been getting the strangest feeling whenever I chat with her. I should have noticed it earlier. Strangest feeling? According to this text, the divine damsel from the opera was actually the daughter of the loving couple. And she didn't volunteer. She was sacrificed. To oh, the master that's really sad. By her own father. So she was, it was her parents. Oh, the truth is even more lamentable than the opera. Now I understand why Shen He said the girl was not as brave as people think. It wasn't her choice to enter that ghastly situation. She was forced into it. That's so sad. Oh, it looks like my father may need to make a few revisions to his beloved opera. Search for more. Oh, there's a chest. Abandoned property belongs to whoever finds it first, so it's legally yours now. Records of Changing Village. So it seems that Shen He's father thought he was summoning a benevolent deity using a magic incantation. But in fact, he summoned an evil god's remains, which took the form of a monster. Who? Which god is this, though? A branch family of exorcists used to live in the east of the village, but in around two weeks, the mother died of disease. The young daughter went missing, and shortly after, the father hanged himself on a tree in the yard of his own house. Wow. It has been confirmed that traces of an evil god's remain were found in the village. The villagers are panicking, and no one is certain whether the evil god's remain are gone for good. Do be careful when you are in this area. We're probably going to fight that evil god. Maybe? His obsessive yearning for his deceased wife led to a terrible tragedy. The villagers moved away in fear without ever learning the truth. And now, this place is deserted. Still, I do wonder what the connection is between Shen He and Ming Jun. We've looked everywhere, but still no mention of Sabrosium. Let's have a look over there. Up here. I think we're getting to the end of this. This is it. Mountainous mis miscellany. Magic engraved on Sabrosium does not wear off easily. Some believe that stone to be a bridge between the living and the dead. However, finding Sabrosium is no easy matter. 
You need to be at the right place at the right time. Legend has it that you may find Sabrosium if you stand in the middle of the lake south of Mount Tianhong at dusk and look in the direction of the setting sun. So basically, we need to go to the middle of the lake south of Mount Tianhong at dusk and we'll find us some Sabrosium. Let's go back and tell Shenhua the news! All right, I guess we're gonna about we're about to win this magic. One year when I was back visiting, I heard a story about a white-haired adeptus from a merchant passing by. I never imagined it was you. I was a very close friend of your father's. I could have stopped him from performing the summoning ritual. I had plenty of chance. He's traumatized. I couldn't bring myself to stand up to him. I just let things happen, let it all escalate. And, well, I bring flowers back here every year. And each time I wish I had a chance to apologize to you. Apologize for what? If you'd stopped him, he'd only have found another way. There is nothing he wouldn't have done for his true love. That's true. Nothing. Do you still hate him? I don't know what I feel. I'm told my fate is to bear the curse of calamity, so my master bound my soul with red ropes to curb my aggression. But it also dampened my emotions, making me dispassionate, like the Adepti. So if you ask me how I feel about the past, if I hate my father or not, the truth is, I feel nothing at all. It must have been so tough for you all these years. So she's kind of being, yeah, she's being suppressed. Shenha, we're back! Oh, then I will leave you all in peace. Shenha, it brings me some solace knowing that you are okay. I'll tell you more about the old times next time we meet. Thanks, mister. We found some info in the end. <laughs> he just turns around and leaves. Shenhua, look. This tells us how to find Sabrosium. All we gotta do is go to the middle of that lake. Hm. Let's go then. Uh, Miss Shenhua, there's something I'd like to talk to you about. Just now, in the village, we found your father's diary. It turns out that many of the details in the Divine Damsel of Devastation are not true to the facts. So I'd like to change them. Why? I know I say that opera always deviates from the truth. But now that the main character is standing right here in front of me, I cannot simply dismiss your lived experience in favor of my father's fiction. It's okay. I like your version. My master once said that the day I learn how to use my strength for the good of others is the day that I can truly become part of human society. So, I hope that one day I might be brave enough to stand up and protect others, just like the girl in the opera. See, but she's not, yeah, she, she's got some kind of emotion, right? But I've never thought this way before, and I wonder whether I will continue to think in this way. Don't worry. I believe you will. In fact, I think maybe you've already started to become the person you aspire to be. You just haven't had the opportunity to see it for yourself yet. Shenhua! Yunjin! Cut the chit-chat! Let's go! We can't let someone else beat us to it! <laughs> oh my god, Paimon just breaking the emotional moment. Of course. You two shut up! We have a competition! I was getting involved in the in the freaking story and then Paimon just Oh you're right. We have to be here and then probably go to dusk. What time is dusk? Not duck, I said dusk. Oh, it's a 1730. Then I have to look at the sunset, most likely. So it's around this way. Okay. Time. 1730. Let's do 17, 1729. 
Never mind, it didn't matter. I was looking the wrong way anyways. Wait, what is that? Who is that? <gasps> On his birthday! On his birthday! What brings you here? No, what brings you here? Happy birthday! Have they found a solution to the danger in the sea? What danger in the sea? Min Guang didn't tell you. Something has happened in Guyan Stone Forest. According to the contract, as an adeptus, I should not get involved for now. But these things can be unpredictable. I have a contingency plan of my own. Shell, what do you... Only a single mountain lies between here and Liyue Harbor. If things get out of control, I will defend this place myself. Guys, is this part of the quest? Or is did I just find him randomly? I think I just found him randomly. <laughs> It's part of the quest. He's supposed to be there. What brings you here? Again. Okay, okay, but okay, okay, okay. Min Guang didn't something has happened in Guyan, but these things can be unpredictable. Only a single mountain if things get out of control. It's like you blink, you'll miss. That's interesting. I was not expecting to find him here, to be honest. Oh. Oh. Uh, goodness. Goodness. So, are they okay? This is some top quality ore you found. I'm getting close to the end of this end quest. Out of these. Guess now it's my time to shine. Hey everyone, how's the A-team doing? She's so loud. I ran into a bit of a brick wall on my end. She's always Doing's speaking in never caps. never seen a wonder core before, and says it'd take a lot of research for him to get up to speed. Leave the wonder cores to me. I'll work on them while you go about your business. Don't worry. It won't take me too long. Much obliged, Master Zhang. We should look into the Adepti sigils next, but where should we find items relating to the Adepti? I'll sort that out. Oh? Uh, you got this then? Yes. I have been training with the Adepti for years. I know a thing or two about making sigils. When we first met, I told you I came for the Jade Chamber, not the contest. In fact, I came specifically to deliver Adepti sigils. Master heard that Ning Wang was planning to rebuild the Jade Chamber, so she sent me to deliver some Adepti sigils to her. Master also said she hoped that I can take this opportunity to rejoin human society. But now that I'm here, I wonder if I've been removed from the world for too long. There's so much basic knowledge that I lack. You're fine. Don't worry about it. Maybe it won't work for me to stay here after all. No! We but like you. Way, I'm very glad to have met you. And I'll take care of those adept eye sigils. Without knowing the ins and outs of your situation, I can't say whether you should stay or not. But now that our paths have crossed, we'll always have a connection. So if you're ever feeling down, come find me on my ship. There'll be a drink waiting for you. Thank you. So, Master Zhang, I'll need to use your facilities to make the sigils. Wait, Beidou, uh, Beidou is from Liyue or Inazuma? Fine by me. I'm actually curious to see how the Adepti arts work. Maybe I'll learn something. Liyue? She's Liyue, okay. Whew. The sigils are ready. Though they are in some respects inferior to my masters, I can assure you there will be no quality issues. I've finished forging the things you asked for, too. Great! 
Let's go submit them before someone else gets there ahead of us. Alrighty, that's 260 meters away, so maybe we take. I feel like I started Genshin Impact like right on the on the on the good time to start the game. Um, as a new player, of course. Um, the reason I say it is because the characters that are on the banner are like characters that I'm pretty much just meeting. Like last banner, right? I had Beidou and the banner. This banner, there's Shinso, and I just met him too, so. I feel like it's a good time, in a way. Obviously, then there's this guy, right, that I don't know, and I haven't met. And I don't think I'm going to meet in a long time. And then there's also, um, what's the other name? Um, the Kas Kasuha, um, that I also haven't met. And I don't think I'm going to meet in a long time, so... But at least the four stars, like, I met also the, the Lightning Girl, which is this one, right? Already? All three of you found them together. Okay. The Wonder Claws and Adepti Sigils look good. It seems that we found our winners. Oh, yes we are. We are the winners. I hereby announce that the winners of this material procurement contest are... Lucien. Traveler, Yunjin, and Beidou. What? It's over already? I haven't even found the plus strike yet. Oh, I can't believe it. Uh, so close, but so far. You had no chance. There are three main characters. I'd Four. like to invite our three winners to please proceed to the Jade Chamber, where Lady Ningguang is waiting for you. Huh? Where's Beidou? She was right here. Captain Beidou has some business to attend to. She will join later. Please come with me for now. All right, then. Guess we'll head on up to the Jade Chamber first. This has been a long time coming. The last time we went up to the Jade Chamber was ages ago. By when leads you to the Jade Chamber. Combine the Adepti we are going to witness the arise of the Jade Chamber's control compartment. Of the Jade Chamber. The construction of the new Jade Chamber is now officially complete. Once the tethers are released, it will soar into the sky. Thank you all for your work. Yeah! Miss Yun, I've already heard something about the reason for your involvement. You are looking for a venue for your new opera, aren't you? That's right. Lady Ningguang, I would like to hear your opinion. The unveiling of Miss Yoon's grand new opera surely requires a venue of equal grandeur. So what would you say if I proposed that we stage your first performance right here? Wow. In the newly built Jade Chamber. That's crazy. The Jade Chamber offers a splendid panoramic view of the mountains and the bustling city. It is fitting for the finest performance to be hosted in the heavens. I can think of no better stage for you than here, Miss Yoon. Thank you, Lady Ningguang. Then I will prepare my props and other articles shortly. Please allow me to bring all these aboard the Jade Chamber. Kane, thank you so much for the super. Good morning, Lucian Sun. You're handsome every day. <laughs> You're quite welcome. Thank you. It's I appreciate it. Good opera deserves. Oh, the Traveler, Shenha, Paimon. I'll be leaving now. Do come and see my play when the time comes. You're next. What is your question? May I use the bathroom? I should clarify. I do not know your sister's whereabouts. Please, don't waste your question on this matter. Wow. You're a mind reader, Ningguang. Oh well. Guess Paimon will ask a question then. Managing a successful business is not as simple as you might think. Capital, connections, sensitivity to the trends, and instinct for what is a good opportunity. All of these traits are crucial. If you want to know how to make money, I will honor our agreement and give you an answer. But that is not to say that it will work for you. So basically, Paimon just wanted to be rich. Wow. Paimon hadn't even asked the question yet. <laughs> your question was written all over your face. Now look. You helped me rebuild the Jade Chamber. 
and I intend to repay you handsomely for it. So I promise you that should you one day require financial assistance, you may seek employment here. I will pay you at the highest rate of remuneration. Ooh. Oh, great! So next time we run out of Mora, we just need to come to Ningguang? No more questions from us. Shenha, you got a question? Me? Yes, this is a group effort. Thank you. But I don't have anything to ask. Are you sure? This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I'd urge you not to squander it. Yeah, just don't waste it. Uh, hold on a second. Paimon can probably think of another one. Lady Ningguang, do you think I can ever fit in in Liyue Harbor? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Now that is an interesting question. Liyue Harbor is very inclusive. As long as you respect the rules here, you will not be turned away. So, the key is whether or not you yourself can develop a sense of belonging in Liyue Harbor. Hmm. Huh. A sense of belonging? Yes. To become fond of a place, to feel part of it. It always requires a reason. Perhaps someone you've met, or something you've experienced here. Or perhaps you enjoy the atmosphere of Liyue, and you will become accustomed to it. In short... I wonder if she knows. Everyone needs she seems to know a lot. I hope you can find yours soon. I see. Hey, what's going on? I just want to see the Beto always making the freaking entrance. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> it really reminds me of Captain. Come on, Beto. It's your turn. Do you have a question for Ningguang? Me? <laughs> nah, I ain't got any questions. She forced me to help out, so I figured I may as well get involved with the contest. Ningguang. Don't forget what we talked about. It's not going to be easy to deal with. I don't think my fleet can take it on their own. Don't worry. I have made preparations. The wound dressings are ready, and the Millilith have set up an ambush. <sighs> Glad to hear it. Watch your back. Stay alert. Beto? Ningguang? What are you talking about? You'll see when the Jade Chamber ascends. However... It's not the most pleasant topic of conversation. Maybe it's better that you don't know. Ningguang begins to prepare for liftoff. When I first set foot in the Jade Chamber, I stood at the edge of the platform and looked down upon Liyue Harbor far below. At that time, I dreamed that one day the Jade Chamber's shadow would be seen in all seven nations of Tevat. My wish has not changed to this very day. However, it is not only out of consideration for myself that I have built the Jade Chamber anew at this time. I hope the Jade Chamber will always float in the skies above Liyue Harbor, bearing witness to the prosperity and peace of the human world. And I hope that you can all witness it with me. Let the Ascension Ceremony commence! Now she seems like... Before, like before this dialogue, she was talking with like no emotion. And now she seems so passionate that I can feel it. Ooh, animation! Huh? Again! But it's only one, though. Right on cue, the Avenger of the Vortex, Baisht. Who is that? Osile's wife, final follower of the Overlord of the Vortex. Oh. Looks like you knew this was coming. Beto sensed something was stirring in the deep. She warned me months ago. Knowing she harbors hatred toward the Jade Chamber, I chose to rebuild it now as a way of drawing her out. No. Huh? In this human age, the people of Liyue must find a way to open yeah, this God damn, Ningguang! She. In catching! 
and everyone else. <laughs> da 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 da. Wow, this is some really cool animation. Oh no! <gasps> Traveler! Oh? Oh my god, that was a critical hit! Right on his tummy. Aw, Shenha. Don't do it. <gasps> She's. You are a cursed child. Your life brings nothing. <laughs> oh no! No, when a flashback happens, it means the character is going to sacrifice. Please, no. Is the day that you can truly become part of human society. Oh my god, this is so emotional. I hope she doesn't die. Damn, she's cool. Wow, she's strong. That didn't do nothing. It's time for the teamwork. Dude, Genshin Impact cutscenes are insane. She just went down. More? I want more. Oh! What are you doing here? We can't let you be the only one taking this risk. I hardly see this as a I risk. did not think I would actually the fight. I harbor are well prepared, and she is already badly injured. Only sheer willpower is keeping her alive. I may be nearing the end of my stamina. Oh, well, that's a, this is pretty death. easy, right? I think I have the upper hand. Water versus water. Die! Oh, where you go? Where you go? I mean, she. It's a wife. <gasps> There's more than just this. Oh, he's trying to. She's trying to suck me. Oh! Will this do? Oh, what the? Hmm. Hold on, actually... I have a plan. Oh, she's far away. That looked very close by, but I guess not. Oh, there's more than one head! I didn't realize there was more than one head. Don't waste my time. Your life is mine. Huh? Ring cutter. Oh, I got my ulti. It's time, it's time, it's time. I don't think it's gonna freeze though. There's three heads actually.
Transfiguration. Do your master's bidding. Bow your head. Oh, that hurts. Oh, that actually hurts. It's so much chaos going on. Nice one's gone, I think. Oh, the three of them now. Oh, jeez. Oh! Okay. Oh, man, I really like this character. Oh, 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 oh! oh. Oh, that hurt. That actually hit me. Oh, there it is. Let me hit you with this. Nice. Transfiguration. Don't go away. Man. I need to find where it's going to be. It's... It's not that one, right? That's just the head that's distracting me. Here. My will there we go. Nice! We got it! Shouldn't we go after her? Should we? This place is unstable. It is too risky to- Now we should go back up. We should go back up. Cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. <sighs> oh. Are you alright? I'm just a little exhausted. Otherwise, fine. Oh man, you gave me a scare, man. I thought you were gonna sacrifice yourself. I wanted to deal with it myself. I didn't expect you to follow me. Don't worry. She's not coming back anytime soon. After an injury like that, she'll likely seek refuge somewhere else. How did things go underwater? It's been dealt with. She was injured before entering the water. It didn't take too much effort to finish the job. Good. So the crisis has been safely averted. When you visit the Jade Chamber in the future, you will be afforded generous treatment. Lady Ningguang, the fleet reports that the sea monster has left Guyan Stone Forest and the surrounding waters have returned to normal. Thank you. How are the Millilith? Thanks to the medical supplies you prepared and Lady Kuching's command, our losses were minimal. Of course, we owe huge thanks to this young lady for her help. On behalf of the entire Melilith, thank you for your service. Is this the main story? I am not sure. I know I have to do this story, but... I... I don't know. Shenha protected us. Great. Then next time I watch Miss Yun's opera, I'll be able to take the compliments. I wasn't trying to be a hero, though. I just wanted to protect you. Aww. Let the soldiers recuperate, but don't let your guard down. If she returns with a vengeance, we must be prepared. Yes, ma'am. You've been monitoring us for some time now. I trust you've reached a conclusion. Ooh. Hmm. You wish to hear one's opinion. Well, things would have hardly gone so smoothly had it not been for Shen He. That I do not deny. However, final victory was always going to be ours, even had things been a little more arduous. If it came to it, I could always destroy another Jade Chamber. One has observed your adaptation of the Guizhong Ballista, and find oneself compelled to admit that you have evidenced some degree of novel thinking. You have learned from past failures and prepared for this crisis in advance. This is considerable progress compared to the last time. Hence, on balance, one finds your performance during this trial satisfactory enough. But there will no doubt be further trials to come in the future. Do not suppose that one will not continue observing you hereafter. While the position of Tianjuan remains mine, I will always ensure Liyue's safety. Shenhe. One saw you secretly venture out from the mountains a few years ago, and noticed the air of dejection in which you returned. 
Hopefully this trip to Liyue Harbor has been a different experience. Yes. I can't explain it, but... I feel happier than I expected. Hmm. Good. Traveler, please take good care of Shen He. She is a dear child. In fact, one has many fond memories of Shen He's childhood that she may be interested to hear about. There'll be no need for that. Oh. Hmm. They are <laughs> all like this. Fine. Since you care not to listen, one shan't be telling you. <laughs> one shall be going homeward now. Huh. Huh. Please. Huh. Have a good rest. Come to the Jade Chamber when you have recovered your energy. We must celebrate both the completion of the Jade Chamber and the fact that Liyue has weathered another crisis. This banquet must be the most spectacular ever. Nice. Um, um, excuse me while I take these. I don't know if I, I'm gonna need that, but... Wait, they scammed me! Where is it? I've been scammed. That's crazy, I just got scammed out of that. There has to be something on top of this, right? Ooh. Wait, that's a lot. That's not, Wait, that's actually a lot. These are hard to break. Now let's go to the top. What do we have at the top? Uh, nothing I guess. Okay, okay, okay. Next up, we have to go over here. The ch to the J chamber maybe, I think so, yeah. Okay, so I thought actually we would have time for the Dine Slave quest today. I don't think we do. And I don't think I'm gonna be doing it off stream. It's Paimon's first time attending a banquet in the Jade Chamber. Before so I think it might take a little while until we get to Inazuma. All of you here are my distinguished guests. I am determined that each of you thoroughly enjoys yourself. Yeah, because I really wanted to do 10 wishes today. So uh, I'm gonna have to grind a little bit after this quest so that we can do 10 wishes Those and i don't, don't think there'll be time for dance slave because i don't want to keep i don't want to like beverages. leave it on a on a oh, cliffhanger know, you know what i mean so i want to do the but whole quest in one, one stream one. I have you heard miss yun's going to be performing today sure have honestly it's the main reason i'm here i've never missed any of miss yun's performances and i don't intend to start now I hear she's going to perform the divine dance Yeah, I'm probably going to do some like some spiral abyss. The one written by her father. Uh and maybe that'll so help us reach that I've barely a ten pole. The last few nights. Hey, look, Ms. Yun is going on stage. Perhaps we can probably go a little bit into uh what's it called? Fontaine? After this, um just to gather some materials to ascend uh Nouvellet, right? Cuz it's supposed to be a date with Nouvellet. So maybe we'll go to to Is it Fontaine where sh where, where he's from? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh? Wow. Wow.
basically the lore. Wow. Some really good animation. <gasps> We're in there too! Dude, what did you think? Genshin Impact just never that? ceases to amaze me. That's insane. That's just crazy good. That's just insanely good. It was beautiful. It was wonderful. It was wonderful. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. I guess we are made for each other. <laughs> You're welcome. Thanks to you, the Divine Damsel of Devastation is a more nuanced tale than ever. And we got a lot in coming. The play has an ending, but life goes on. I believe you will find a way to fit in in Liyue Harbor. Thank you. Oh, I think I've found the opportunity I needed to change. Ms. Yun. <laughs> Ms. Yun. <laughs> There you are. Good to see you. Huh? Hey, this young lady with the white hair looks like some kind of VIP. Yeah, that's it, like an adeptus. Wait, you're the girl from the opera, aren't you? The divine damsel herself. And look who else we have here, the illustrious traveler. Well, I'll be. <clears throat> this was definitely worth showing up for. He's, he's drunk, that's why. Let me pull up a chair. All right. We'll all have a friendly chat. Get better acquainted. <sighs> Alternatively, you could leave us alone. That is, if you'd prefer to finish your drink via the orifice <laughs> of your own choice. <laughs> God damn, bro. <laughs> Uh-oh. This feels all too familiar. <laughs> Shen has back to her old <laughs> self again. It seems she still has a long way to go. Hey, what are you doing? Calm down, Shenha. Calm down. Hey, there we go. There we go. We got we got some things to claim here. A lot of primos. Any other primos over here? That I missed? Nope. Okay. We Let's see look for a new how many I have. 900. So Lord if I do Lord. some more... Ooh, I got some really cool items. This is a pretty cool place, not gonna lie. Really, really nice. But yeah, let's um... Let's get some primos. I think first, before we go into Fontaine, I want to try... The Spiral Abyss. Am I healed up? No, I have to heal up first. 
Unlock waypoints in the mains? I could do that, but I'm too lazy. I am very, very lazy. I want to try Spiral Abyss. It's been a while since I've tried Spiral Abyss. I might not be able to make it. So, if we can make it, I will go to Fontaine. Uh, ascend. Nuvillette. And then, come back to Spiral Abyss. Okay, so... I still have to complete this one. Chamber 1 and 3. Cryo damage by all party members increase. I wish I had... Uh... Shinha. That would... That would be really crazy good. Um... Um... I will need this into Brick Shields. This. In case there is any shields. Character damage. Sprint. Character defense, minus 15. Attack, plus 40. Character movement speed. For this floor. No, I think this one is good. I can't switch characters now. The tides beckon. Silence. That shouldn't take that long, right? <laughs> it shouldn't take that long. Be sanctified. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy, though. <laughs> this character is just broken. <laughs> Elemental burst. Character, normal, and charge attack. Max HP, this one here. Damn, that's actually insane. Bow your head. Oh wait, hold on, this might be bad. No, they're immune! No! Ah, uh, this is where I'm... This is where they get me. This is where they get me. Okay. This is going to take a while, isn't it? Why are they all water? Body and mind. Time to act. Boba, get them. At least this one's not timed, so I think I might be fine. There we go, okay. It's Your life is mine. Please, okay, nice. Wait, I just need to kill this one. Okay, nice, nice. There's no time for this one, so it's good, it's good. 88%, not bad. Ah, uh, more water ones? Seriously? Ah. 
I don't know if I can do this. Okay, maybe maybe this will break it because they're not immune. It's only it's only the little blobs. Oh man, that sucks. Right when I need Fischl, I can't use her because I didn't put her in. Oh, he's immune. Okay, never mind. Um. Oh. Okay, I still got it. Woo. Woo. Elemental mastery. Restore twenty five percent. Uh, attack plus forty percent. I think elemental mastery. Aye, right, we're fine. As long as it's no more water. No more water, please. Okay, die, 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 die. Please. <laughs> Rain outlines your fate. Oh my god, more water. Are you serious? These are going to take so long. Maybe this will do. Maybe it'll. No, it doesn't do anything to them. Uh. It's gonna take so long. One down, one down, one down. Okay, one down, one down. Maybe I still got it. Maybe I still got it. I still got it, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, <laughs> get me down! <laughs> okay, and you're dead. Do I still got it? Please, please. No! I hate this. Why is it when I bring freaking Fischl, I get to fight the, the freaking... Thunder people! <laughs> Man, do I have to do it all over again? I probably do. <sighs> okay. I got this. I can do this. Yeah. I can do this. This is easy. It's just literally Nuvolet. Nuvolet carry. Rain outlines your face. Rain. Easy. 
That was fast. Nice. Okay. Good. Next one will be easier. Um, normal and charged. This one here. It will be easier, right? Because now I have Fischl. Although she doesn't have a really... I, I think I didn't equip her with anything. So, I don't know. Maybe... Okay, this is a little faster for sure, yeah. Still a little bit slow. Come here, come here, come here. Wow, that took a long time. I right, know you! No, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to switch to this character. Oh no, wait. No rest for the wicked. Why is she not? I'm not dealing any damage. Oh my god. It's not it's not targeting me. Stop. <laughs> No! Does it matter if I already did it though? Does it matter if I already did it? Will it will it count? Because I already finished this one though, right? So it shouldn't matter. You're good? Okay, okay, okay. I was worried. I was worried. Yeah, die, you stupid thing. Like, you're so annoying. Single-handedly make me lose. And I'm gonna have to versus two. Attack plus 40%. Yes. Mine, I don't care the defense. I think I'm just going to focus on this one first. Where is... <laughs> yeah, 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 let's go! Okay, one down. Die! Oh, oh my god. Let's go! Do I just continue or do I leave? Do I continue or do I leave? I'm pretty sure I'm done. Floor 3, Chamber 1. I think I'm done, right? This is the third one. Oh, if I continue, it's a new floor. Okay, so increases swirl damage by 300%. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here, so I don't know if there's going to be shields. Um, so I'm just going to go with my usual party, I guess. What if there's ice with shields? Is there going to be something with shields? Yeah. The Cryo Slime. So... I know the Ningguang is pretty good for it. Alright, let's do it. I should be fine though. 
The Everlasting Whisper of the Spiral Abyss encourages you to go deeper. Uh, elemental character. Elemental mastery. I'm not sure what mastery is, though. Like, do I get more power with it, maybe? I don't know. Imagine if I had Kasuha here right now. Be sanctified. Bow your head. Time to act. Witness the power of Gugwa. Body and pet rain outlines your Okay, this is actually taking a little longer than I thought it would take. Because they're just appearing and appearing. The tides beckon. Settle down. Nice. Did I finish? Where's the last one left? Oh. That one. Just how I thought. Yep. Just what I thought. And then this guy to finish it off. Nice! That was... that was not that hard. Sprint, stamina, character, elemental skill, damage. I think this is good, yeah. Alrighty, here we go. Bow your head. I got terrible. Rain outlines your face. Uh, Let hey, yeah. Boba, get that tingle. Uh, Settle uh, down. Uh, 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 the tides uh, beckon. Uh, I got terror. Uh, 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 I think I missed a little bit. How dare you hit me! There we go, and then again. <laughs> I just threw him away. I'm like, I have no time for you. I'm sorry. I have other business to attend here. Silence! There's more. Oh my god, do I even have enough time? Guys, I don't know if I have enough time. Maybe I do, maybe I do, maybe I do, maybe I do. We trust, we believe. Come on! Oh my god! Oh, that was so close. That was so close. Woo! Oh, very clutch, very clutch. Instant restore snow when character HP is greater than 50%. Oh, this is really good though. Uh, damage within 5 8 seconds of sprint. I'm taking this one, although the attack is not really necessary for me. 
Character damage within 8 seconds of sprint, plus 20%. No, I think this one's the best one. Yeah. Eluzines are beautiful creatures. Are beautiful they creatures. Are the of they are the pride Be of Fontaine. Sure to cause them no harm. Oh. Silence. The tides Can I do this? Maybe. I should have probably done a reaction, to be honest. No, I think I got this. This is very easy, actually. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, let's keep going. Um, electro damage dealt by all party members increased by 75. Electro damage. So that means that we're having Hydro, so it's going to be really annoying. Okay, this is going to be really annoying, chat. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of Hydro. Um, let's get these four again. We're probably going to have uh, some pretty good, some pretty good Primos after this. When character HP is higher, I think this is one's actually insane. Especially for new V. Immune already. I don't care. I'll have reaction right here. I need to get rid of these guys first, though. They're annoying. Bow your head. Let the mighty be humble. How are they so tanky, though? Oh, what? No, <laughs> that's gonna be the death of me, I swear. No, it's a freaking mages too! Oh, uh, with a freaking shield. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, that got me, that got me, that got me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, I'm not gonna make it in time. No! And I got caught in it! No! Wait. He's the last... No, he's not even the last one, chat. This is gonna be insanely hard. They're so tanky, I don't have enough damage for this. Yeah, I don't have enough damage for this. And there's even more... Alright. I can't do this one. This one's hard. I am not strong enough for that. I am not gonna be suffering. Wait, what? Abandon, yeah. I got a hundred. Not bad. And a hundred. Not bad. This one, though, hmm. You know, I can't. It's, it's too difficult. Um, let's see. We got a thousand one hundred. Uh, let's go to... How do we go to Fontaine? That one is really hard because... I don't have characters for it. I just don't have characters for it. Um, can I ascend her? I don't even have enough materials to ascend her. You can teleport? Have you finished the cat event? I have, yes. Uh, 
I don't even know where Fontaine is. There's an open waypoint in Sumeru Desert. I, I haven't even gone to Sumeru. I thought somebody said that I can go straight from Onstad. There's a teleport? From Liyue. Scroll up more? That's all I can scroll up. I don't see anywhere I could teleport. Oh. What is that? Ooh. Oh, wow. Whoa, whoa, what's going on with my screen? <gasps> what are those birds? The music. I feel like I'm playing a different game. What in the... Is that a monster? Look at those birds! The world opens itself before those with noble hearts. Wow. That looks sick. Alrighty. Eh? Did light just start fluting from the Statue of the Seven just now? Not so weird. A rush of water. It certainly is a nation of the Hydro Archon. Even the Statues of the Seven are water fountains. Yeah, right. That light wasn't normal at all. Lucien, you didn't feel uncomfortable at all. The water's speaking to me. Like Paimon's gonna believe you. If you can crack jokes like that, you must be fine. Though, after it lit up like that, the air does feel a lot more humid. Maybe it's because of all the hydro energy that was released. Hey, hey, Paimon heard that in Fontaine, if you can use elemental energy properly, you can swim underwater. Maybe you can even find sunken treasure. Paimon, leave diving for treasure to you. Paimon will stand on the shore and wait for you. It'll be lonely going underwater alone. Ah, but, but, but being in water is scary. What if Paimon accidentally gets swept in the current and get all turned around and dizzy? And then she won't be able to fly away no matter what. Just like before Paimon met you, back in Mondstadt. Then... I'll fish you out again. Aww. Really? Then maybe Paimon can try going underwater with you. Hmm. You'd better not back on your word. Damn, I turn into Nuvalet. That's crazy. Okay, anyways... What is that? What is this? Water. Okay. Fontaine's blessing. Alright, so. We are looking for. Where do I find this? It says it's crafted. Check the enemies tab. Or I can find Lumi Toil. Transsoan. Transso. Sanic. Sanic. Transoceanic pearl. Dropped by Fultimer Aberrants. Where are these creatures? Let's go, let's start there. Where is that? Also, why can't I come here? How come I can teleport there? When? Since when? 
Oh, that's kind of cool. Wow. This might be my favorite. This really might be my favorite uh, nation. It looks like everything's so pretty. It's right up there. And I haven't even like finished the whole thing, you know, like I just started looking at this fontaine. Whoa. <gasps> they drop what I need. I have to fight this thing. <gasps> oh, I was going to be like, hell no. There's underwater massive creatures. Let's make it to the shore. I need to get the the crabs. I need to kill the crabs. Oh, it's a little boar. I haven't seen those before. <gasps> I do need these, right? Like these, these, these. Yeah. How many of those do I have to find? Um. I need 10. Oh, that's the seahorse that I have to kill, right? I think this is a little too powerful for me, maybe. No way, like... They're all immune? It's going to be hard to be, like, l playing this character here, actually. I thought it'd be easier. Oh, my God. They're not letting me. They're, like, interrupting me. I think it's time for Fischl. I think it's time for Fischl back. This might be really difficult. Don't waste my time. No, my sword. Witness the power. Good one. The music is really good, though. I really like it. I really can't wait to start exploring this place once I get here with my main quest. It probably might take a little while, because I think Sumedu is first, right? Or is it Fontaine first? Which one comes first in the main story? Sumedu first, so yeah, it's going to take a while for us to get here. But it's okay, you know? We have all the time in the world. That's one gun. Oh my god, okay, those are very hard to kill. I bet Fischl can just kill them fast. Rain outlines your fate. You're All of that for nothing. All of that for nothing. 
So I have to get my official back. In the name of the princessin. Alright, now it will be so much easier. Uh, I even forgot what I was here for. I was here to gather some little starfish. There we go. Oh, those look... Strong? Ooh, that's a big chest. I really like the music. It's very theatrical. If that makes sense. Let the record oh. Show that I verbally consent to oh, that only gives five. Your position. I thought it'd be more. Fontaine is a theatrical nation? Wow, I guess I guessed it right. I mean, it's pretty obvious. What did I get? Four, six, I need four more. Just going through this war. Wow, there really is so much to this game. I haven't found any more starfish. And the flowers here are very pretty too. Is everything just pretty in this in this nation? Oh my god. They're just following me. Oh, I, yeah, I really love how theatrical it is. It's just so, so much more... I don't know how to say it. More more impactful. More... Like, I feel like I'm actually in danger. Or like, it's inspiring. Um... Okay, maybe there's no more starfish over here. So how about I go back and I go the opposite way instead? Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. I didn't even notice that I made it almost back to the beginning. I have to kill these two, right? Yeah. No, those are not the ones that I have to kill. Hold on. It's kind of hard because I'm very I'm not used to these materials. Uh I mean, I guess it's it is them. But they dropped me something that I didn't need. Do you think these also drop it? No, my soul. Oh, those are the ones that actually drop it. There we go. Oh. Oh, that's a very cute flower, too. <laughs> Why are there so many chests? I wonder if Fischl really is strong here. Yeah, I think it's a lot easier now. I can actually do damage. <laughs> although, although it's not as easy as... As it seems.
There you go. I took the damage though. Oh, I accidentally killed this. Nice. What does this give me? Only five? Yeah, that's it. Just five. I like it. Oh, well, it does give me another item. Straight to the point, though. Straight to the points. What are those things? What are those flying things? Gameplay tutorial. Oh, it's like a game. It's gonna take a while, actually, I think. Oh, what? Hmm? Oh, I thought it'd be easier than that. I didn't know that it was like a... What the frick am I- what- what is this? I don't know what I just did. What is the Hydro Core for? Huh? Yeah, but it's clearly not what I think it is. It only stays here as long as I stay here. I still don't get it though. I must I probably should have clicked the tutorial. <laughs> I probably should have clicked the tutorial. Naturally, a hydro-abundant nation like Fontaine will have such mysterious phenomena as Hydrogramma. Hydrograna. After you collect three Hydrograna, they will combine into a hydro core that will continuously apply hydro to the surrounding environment. Even if you have not yet collected three of them, char char characters can cause Hydrograna to grow into a hydro core if continuously affected by hydro. This mystical creature construct seems to have originally been designed to test the dampness of its surrounding but it seems that it, it can only detect its own dampness and react accordingly. In situations where it might continually be affected by hydro, maybe something nice, unexpected may occur. Okay, okay. So, like, if I grab this. Down. I did that without. Okay, what? I'm confused. I'm still confused, by the way. I still have no idea what I'm doing. It did not tell me anything. Huh? I read the tutorial, and I still don't understand. Somebody help me. <laughs> what?
found your head. What like what did I just do? What does that even do? Bro, no way it was just as simple as freaking doing it at the same time. Then what's the point? I've learned nothing. Is it what you wish to find? Hopefully the excitement of opening a treasure chest has at least made it a worthwhile experience. Oh wait, no, I see the point. Hold on, chat. Maybe I see the point. <laughs> Wait, what? Alright, that's too much work. That's too much work right now. How do I do this? Where's the other Sealy that I'm missing? I don't see a Sealy. I want that chest! I just I just wanted to get starfish and then I just It's so confusing coming from you know never being here before Oh, I need these guys. Hello, I'm sorry for disturbing you, but I need to kill you. Ha 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 ha. Nice. Just what I needed. Now, is there any starfish over here? No. No starfish over here. This monster's underwater or something. Oh, there's something here. It's a flower. It's a pluey lotus. Ooh, it's a lotus. Chat, did I ever tell you lotus is one of my favorite flowers? What the flip am I supposed to do here? Am I cheating? Oh, I cheated. Destiny has I'm cheating. I skipped all the steps. Where can I find those starfish? I don't see them anymore. Eh? Wait a minute. Guys, there's no stamina. Oh, there is stamina. Whoa! What the flip? What the heck is this?
However, there's still no star, no starfish. Will I ever die from this? Whoa! I'm like a freaking whale. Wait, that's crazy. It's a whole world under the sea. Yeah, but there's no starfish though. Wait, what is that? Sh uh huh? Look for hidden treasures nearby. Yeah, what's this? Huh? What did I just do? I am so confused. I am actually so confused right now. That doesn't do anything though. Am I doing something? Am I doing something? <laughs> I don't understand what I'm doing. Chat, this is too hard. God, thank you so much for the super. Thank you, thank you, chat. I don't, I don't. I'm stupid. I'm chat, chat. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I just want to get starfish. I don't know. This is too much for me. Around. It's so overwhelming. I. It's just too much. I'm not ready for this. I'm just not ready for this. I'm stupid. I didn't think it would be so much. I just want starfish. That's all I'm looking for. But there's none. 
How how do I find those? What the hell? They're dancing. What is this? Alright, this is too much for me. This is just too much for me. I just want starfish. Alright, you here. Die. It's truly all I want. Just to kill these little crabs. Did it not drop anything? There you go. How many more do I need? But I can't even pick these up. So, like, I'm confused. I have 6 of 15. 1 out of 3. Why is this so difficult? <laughs> There's more crabs over here though, so... I'm sorry, Haley Churl, I'm not here for you. There's a chest right here. I don't want to really fight the chest. Guys, you're all saying underwater, underwater. I literally went underwater for like 10 minutes. I did not find a single starfish. I am not going underwater again. Unless necessary. Okay, are you going to tell me where to go? I hate Fontaine. I hate Fontaine. I just, I hate Fontaine. Everything's so weird here. Why is everything so weird and different? Why is everything so weird? <laughs> this, this, this nation is just too, too big head for me. My brain is still in Liyue. You, you don't understand, chat. My brain is still in Liyue. I'm, I'm stupid. And I'm here just by the shore, trying to find some starfish. But there's none. How many shores does this map have? <laughs> Where else can I go? Never mind what I said. Fontaine is not my favorite map. There's more different monsters. And what the frick is this? There's no shore.
Yeah, there's no, there's no shore. I guess. I don't know. I'm just confused. I feel like I've been, I've been walking and walking and I, there's just nothing. How hard really is to farm the materials for this dude? I've already been here. There's nothing here. This music is very Hispanic. Like Spain kind of music. I like it. At least there's something good about this though. Maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe I'll get lucky and I'll find some here. There's none over here. Also, yeah, I know, chat. I know I can use interactive map. But hear me out. What if I don't? You know what I mean? What if I just play the game without actually looking at an interactive map? Just hear me out. Just hear me out. What the flip is this? That looks scary. But I kind of want to make it over there. I love the music though, for sure. Uh, maybe there, maybe there. Oh, there is... Is that a... Hold on. Oh, maybe I could go there. Let's dive! What does this button do? Oh, nothing. I still don't even know what that does. It's like a whip or something. Like, pow! <gasps> okay, maybe, maybe? This seems to be a good place to find starfish. Yeah, I mean, definitely is a good place. They're just dead. Okay. It wasn't all in vain. I can kill a crab at least. I can fulfill my hobby in this island too. Thanks. Oh my god, that's a massive crab though. Die. Die. I will kill you and your future generations. They did not drop anything? What a waste. I'm sorry, little boy. You gotta go. Okay, but still, no starfish. Silence. Damn. Okay. 
What is this? Seems to be like some sort of... Treasure. What the heck was that? Wave Rider Waypoint. Oh, this is a waypoint. Oh, wait, that's actually pretty cool. I didn't even notice. I also didn't notice that the thingy is here. I can't believe I've been playing this game for four hours almost. Wow, I just got lost in this world and I just didn't realize. Nice, an achievement. Okay, but I don't care about that. I just want some starfish. Starfish die just apparently does not exist in this game. Oh, that's a cute whale. Can I kill it? Oh, I can. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Honestly, just I, I think I will never ascend this guy. Down. Be sanctified. What did I get from that? Let me check the character. Ascend. I don't even have enough for anything. It's just impossible. They just don't exist. They just don't exist. The only way, the only place that I really found some from was here. Like, the, here. And there were just no more. There are literally just no more. Do they, like, respawn every every now and then? Like, how much is the time? I even forgot how they look like. It's been so long. What the heck is this, even? Oh, uh, just fish on the floor. Okay. It's just insane. I've never struggled so much. Silence. At least I'm getting those. Give me. And some just don't drop him. That's how hard it is. Oh my god. Some just don't drop it. Damn. Okay. Yeah, definitely not this side. Definitely not this side. Uh, Maybe on this side? It's over. Yeah, it's over. No, not on this side for sure. I'm just gonna... I'm just not gonna... Oh, what is that? Wait, I have to check that out. <gasps> Ooh, interesting. Do I have to hit it to open it? Maybe. Nice. Bow your head. However, I've been finding everything but starfish.
Okay. Nice. We see a freaking mage. Hell no. Okay, let me let me check that. Achievements. I don't even know what achievement I got. Five? Okay. Character. Ascend. We have 15 of these, finally. <sighs> we need these. Maybe I can fight that monster. Uh, let's see where, where that monster is. It's right here. How do we get there? I guess we have to go across. I don't know if I, I can even, but we can try. Seems to be on that, that spot over there, maybe. It's over. Wow, that's a lot. What's that? Tidalga. Looks cute. Damn, there definitely is a lot to explore. Oh my god. There's a waypoint here. Then we go up. There's another waypoint. I don't know if... Oh, it's down there. Ooh, there's something red. Okay, we're getting... Oh, it's down there, isn't it? Hold on, there's some treasure here. More, okay. Not bad, not bad. Um, I wonder if it's up here though. Maybe it's not. So where's where's the boss? I totally passed it. Maybe there's starfish here. There's a little treasure. Let's go! We found one! Oh my god, it only took three hours! And that's it. Oh, oh! We need two more, two more. There we go. Holy frap! That took so long. Unnecessarily long. There's the last one. It's over. Yes, it finally is over. Let's see. Now we just need to fight that monster and that's it, I think, right? That should be around it. Let's go. Let's go underwater. I do not know what to expect, so wish me luck. I am guessing it's here somehow? Or is it down there where I thought it was?
Oh, ow. Oh, that hurts, I think. I don't know. Oh, what the flip? Oh. Red meanies. Huh? What does that do? Okay, so what does that do? High pressure vent. As the name suggests, the high pressure water vent can spray out underwater currents and move characters or certain objects. When you have an armor craft shield from an armor craft, you can resist the current's propulsion. Throw a hat shaped bombs that explode at your command. Hold aim. But that doesn't do anything though. Oh! That's pretty cool. So what can I do with that? Can I explode this thing, maybe? My health is super low, to be honest. Let me just get myself some food. That's enough. Oh! Whoa! Oh, wait, where? Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so... The real question here is... Am I supposed to go inside this? No. Is it down there? Why is it so hard to get to, like... Why, why is everything so, like, gigabrain in this thing? I am confused. Where is the monster? Where? Here, but, un but under... But what does that do?
Okay, but what what does that do? What does that do for me? Did I activate something and now it's like Now it's like here? I, I'm confused, chat. I need help. I'm confused. I don't get it. I don't understand. My brain isn't braining. Is it here? It's a different key, but it's right here. Is it like over here at the top? It's right here. Is this bruh, there's no way you're also gonna give me more puzzles bro you're gonna give me more puzzles my brain's gonna die today I swear my brain's gonna die today I'm done with brain work another one right there. That the one? No, there's nothing in here. But I'm so far away from the boss now. I really don't understand why it's so complicated. Maybe I'm just stupid, like, January, like, actually, I just, ever since I got into Fontaine, I'm just stupid. This, this nation is big brain. My brain isn't braining today. No, not right now. There is a waypoint here. Right here. Where? Inside a cave. How do I enter this cave? Through here? What the heck is this? There's so much going on here, honestly.
This better be the easiest boss ever. You better be easy. Why is there no water? I just realized. Okay. Oh, oh god. Okay. Be not perturbed. I am unscathed. Silence. No, my sword. Confound your head. Maybe this boss has like faces or something. This is definitely not gonna do anything, but I'm just gonna throw it in there anyways. I think I'm doing pretty good. As long as it doesn't heal, I think we're fine. Oh god! Wait, this is not good. I need a heal, there we go. Woo! That was close. I'm glad this guy actually just heals. This is not that hard. Please don't change. Please don't change your pattern. I would appreciate it. Okay, not bad, not bad. Okay, it's not too bad, chat. It's not too bad. I thought it would be harder. Maybe Nubilet is just broken. I, this is scary. This is scary. This is actually scary. I might die here. Never mind, because I heal full health. Let's go. This character's broken. Woo! It's like you can't just you can't punish this character. It's so overpowered. Ooh. Settle down. Hmm. Oh, reveal thyself. Rain outlines your 
What the? Where are you going, buddy? Oh, obviously there has to be a way to kill this thing. Ah, uh, I see. There's always a trick, of course. Yeah, of course. It's going to heal, isn't it? Okay, no, never mind. I can just kill it now. It has a shield, and I just realized that it doesn't matter. Because New Village just goes through it. I thought it was like a trick or something. Oh, it's easy. Alright, let's just heal back. Nice. Yeah. I'll use it. Oh my god, it... It, it only gave us one. Mother... F I hate grinding. And it also gave us purple thingy, not blue one. Where do I get the blue one? That's crazy. All of that for that. All of that for that. Um, I want to go back to Liyue. I want to go back to Liyue. Where's my Liyue? Where's my dear Liyue? Here's my dear Liyue. My dear Liyue, I missed you so much. Genshin, never change. Never change, please. I believe I can make the blue ones with this, right? So, let me grab a couple. I'm gonna grab ten, actually. Yeah. And then all I have to do is just go into the thingy. Uh, what's it called? I think I can find it right here. The crafting table. There you go. We need these, right? I can only craft three? That's all I need. Right, right? Anything? No? Okay, good. Characters. Ascend. Yeah, so I have everything but this thing. And the only way to get it is by killing this guy. Right. There's nobody else that drops that item specifically. Just that and it respawns every what 10 minutes maybe every every 10 minutes or so five minutes a few minutes we got a thousand thousand we don't even have for 10 wishes by the way it's around four minutes We don't even have enough. However, we could. We could if chat helps me. Um, I have. I have keys. I need help. Also, what is this? I can't use it right now. I have keys. Yeah, I have shrine keys. But I've already, I've already done a lot of the shrines. So it'll be harder. It'll be harder. Chat, you are allowed to cheat for this one. Because I don't want to take too long in finding a shrine. So, ooh, common chest. Where? Oh, for free? Abandoned property belongs to whoever finds it first. So, it's legally yours now. <sighs> There's nothing here. Oh, whoopsie. 
We are in shore? Yeah, that's why. You can just tell me and I'll look for it. If I open it, we move on to the next one. The one near Dragon Shrine. Um, Dragon Shrine? Dragon Spine. I believe this is Dragon Spine, so I'm guessing you're saying this one here, right? Dragon Spine. I have not, maybe. Now, near. What do you mean by near? Because, you know, there's a lot of places that are near. On a cliff near Storm Terrace Lair. Oh, that's a little far away. Uh, I'll check that one after. In front of the domain. So, like... Oh, yeah. I think I opened it. Let me check, just in case. But I think I might have already opened it. Yeah, okay. I did. Already opened it. Next one. Dada Upa Gorge. Mm. Have you tried Bright Crown Canyon Canyon Lift Griff Cliff Cliff? Let me let me check this one first. Uh yes, I did it. Um the next one is Bright Cry Bright what? Bright Crown. Where is Bright Crown? Canyon Glyph. I think we did this last time we were looking for one. I, I believe we did this one. However, I'm not exactly sure because I don't know where. <laughs> At the very cliff on of uh, the very cliff on the right. <laughs> the very cliff on the right. Oh, there's one. Nice. Good job, chat. Good job. Good job. Let's go. That's one. Then somebody said in Wolvendom. Is it what you wish to find? Wolvendom. In Wolvendom. Wolvendom. Like right here? Wolvendom. Exactly where in Wolvendom? There's two teleports in Wolvendom. There's this one and there's this one. And then there's a shrine. Would it be close to the shrine? I mean, not shrine, sorry. Domain, that's the word. But near the domain. North to the domain? Yeah. South. I think we actually did this one last time, too. Ba -ba -boom. <laughs> or maybe I am just mistaken and this is not... We haven't done this one. Yeah, I think we already did this one, by the way. I think so, I believe. Was it up there? Like up there, right? I think we did. <laughs> oh, we haven't. Nice. We actually haven't. 
Nice, nice. Good job. Thank you. Is it what you wish to find? All right, let me check. We have 1,296 plus one. I believe to have 10 wishes, we would need... 1,400. So 1,360. Right? So we need 160 more. Where can I... Yeah, where can I get 200 more? Because there's no way that uh, unlocking these things, I... I will. I guess it would be this, but... Primo domains. I don't know. Like this one here, maybe. Perhaps. Oh, this one seems hard. No, actually, this is not too hard. It's gonna be hard to kill the little guys, but at least they're fire, you know? They're the least annoying, probably. Oh my god, let me live! Uh -huh. Jesus, chill. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Oh my god. Okay, nice. He's dead, he's dead. Alright, he was the most annoying. Now you guys. First you, because you have no shield. Wait, never mind. You have a shield now. At least it's not timed. Nice, okay. That was 40 for free. Easy. 45, actually. That was pretty easy. Yeah. The Abyss Mages were so annoying. Although that guy was really annoying, though. Okay, that's 40. Uh, what other one requires or gives me that much? This one gives me five. Oh, just for unlocking. But I think I can't unlock this one. Can I? I think it's like a puzzle, right? Maybe there's one here that I still haven't done. This one also gives me five for unlocking. Uh, not this one. This one here, but I haven't gone here yet. So I guess it's time to explore. A little bit. Heal me, thanks. How far away is it and where is it is the question. Uh, very far, very far. It's across this mountain. So we're gonna go this way probably. We're going on a trip on a... Ooh, wait. We can't say no to that one, though. We cannot say no to that one. That was a big one. 
How much is it? Like five? So, how do I get this? Oh, I gotta kill this guy. That's it. That was not it. I have to go someone else. Probably that guy. No! We're fighting on a tree. Die. This is probably not worth it to five, honestly. It's probably not worth it to five. I don't even know what I have to do, to be honest. Is that it? No, there's more. Oh, that's it. Okay. Okay, worth it, worth it. Is it what you wish to find? And Hopefully oh, it's ten actually. Treasure chest has at least made it a worthwhile. Even experience. better than I thought it would be. Not bad. Oh my God! How how hard is it to climb? Seriously, seriously. You gotta, you gotta be joking. You, you have to be freaking joking. You have to be joking, bro. <laughs> was it, was it that hard? Was it really that hard, newbie? This game really tests my patience. I think I just, it's just, I've just been playing for too long, and that's why. I think that's just, that's literally the only reason. <laughs> Let me get to that stop. It's Fontaine. I think Fontaine just broke my head. It really did. It just messed up with my emotions and my my thinking. It broke my dreams, my hopes. I'm not ready for Fontaine. I'm happy where I am right now. I kind of miss Liyue already, even though I'm in Liyue. So it's right here. Yes. I feel like this one's going to be difficult though, for sure. Oh, it's a puzzle. Great. I don't have the character for this. Awesome. Let's make haste. I mean, at least it should have told me. I get a key for this. It's a Liyue Shrine key. Oh, that means that we, we get uh, an extra 40. That's good. Well, that's, that's pretty good. Ah, yes, the puzzles. Yes. Oh. Okay. 
Okay, I got it. Good, 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 good. So this one and this one. And then this one. And this one. Then this one. And this one. Ah? Wait, that's so weird. So... Okay, that one turns them off. But then this one... Should turn them... Okay, it does, it does. That's confusing. Okay, okay, okay. One. This is easier to follow now. Four. But why did it not... I'm so confused about that, though. Oh, I thought that would actually do something. Huh. Guys, I'm not using my brain. I'm just using, like... A way, like a pattern or something. But I'm, I can't find it. My brain, I'm not using my brain at all. I'm just trying to find like some sort of pot pattern without like looking at anything. Eventually it'll come. This one. See, like sometimes it's just weird. And then for some reason, this one turns this one off when it used to turn it on. I wonder if these actually have like some sort of like clue in it that you should be able to follow. Maybe they do, I don't know. Okay, one, two, Never mind. We're just gonna be here forever. Honestly. Never ending stream, guys. Never ending stream. I just want a 10 pull. That's all I want. How difficult is it really? How difficult is it really? I wish there was a way to know. Maybe it's a sound cue?
At least this is the like the one puzzle. I mean, I will get it for sure. I will get it. It's just going to take a while. One. I've already been here before. I've been here before. Let's do the opposite. It lights up everything. I wish I could just unlight them up, to be honest. It would be so much easier. Let's go from left to right. Maybe brute forcing it like that will do. One, two. At least I'll see a pattern here. Okay, so this is new. So, okay, same thing. Let's skip this one now. Let's do this. We skip that one. Go here, we skip this one. We skip this one. And then we go back to the start. We do this one. We skip this one, this one, this one. We do this one. Then we do this one. Then there's only one left, but... I think mm, I'm not sure though. I'm not I really I'm really not sure. One, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. So I don't I don't get what the it's just there obviously has to be like something to look at on the ground, right? Like something that really tells you. I just don't have the brain to be looking around for it. Just gonna start shooting everywhere and eventually I'll get it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> wow, what a big brain. Yeah. Woo! Now we get to the story, people. Let's go. Ow, ow, how dare you stop me! Yeah, you get down, get down, get down. You don't deserve special treatment. It's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. We'll get a four star, by the way. Oh, there's this is timed. Wait, hold on, chat. This is timed. I can't be playing games like this. Ow, that hurts.
Like after a freaking puzzle and you give me a timed challenge that's even harder? You can't be serious. At least it's just this guy who is really hard. Thankfully, I am almost uninterrupted. Because Nuvelet is just broken. Then this one here, pop, 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 pop. And then the last guy that's gonna heal me up. Nice. We got the 40 primos. We also got the little thing, right? I believe, I haven't opened a single uh, Liyue Shrine. Uh, let me see, I think I have a key now, right? Wait, do I not? Yeah, I do, right? I have two Liyue Shrines, which should be enough for us to do a temple. Um, now, chat, it's your turn. Wait, what is this? Oh, I don't know what that is. Okay, cool. Chat, it's your turn. Guide me to a Liyue Shrine. I have not opened a single one. I believe there's one right here. I remember seeing one right over here. But I forgot where. I just forgot where, but I know it's it's over here. Or maybe it was close to the other thing. Maybe it was it was maybe it was close to uh here actually. You did great. <laughs> Honestly, in pain and pain. I am in pain. <laughs> Crimson Witch Domain. Crimson Witch Domain. Crimson Witch Domain. I do not see that on the map. Domain you just did. Uh, which one did I just do? Was it this one? There's been many flavors to the discerning palate. Mondstadt's water is crisp and pure, while water from Liyue has an enduring aftertaste. In Inazuma, the water possesses a depth of flavor unlike mm. another. Sumeru's water has a rich and complex Stop talking, bro. But it must be savored patiently to fully appreciate it. Nope. Well, definitely not visible through here, so not here. I swear, though, that I saw a shrine, and I always saw, like, all the time, I passed it, and I was like, I can't open it because I don't have a key. In Share Village. Where is that? Village, 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 here. It's the domain next to the ocean end. So, shouldn't I be able to see it close by? Uh, I don't see it here. Maybe it's up here. 
No. <laughs> it's the other waypoint of Kinja. Climb up? Nope. You mean this one? Because there's three. <laughs> Um, nothing here. Abandoned property belongs to whoever finds it first. So oh. it's legally yours now. What the? Hello? <laughs> Behind the mountain. <laughs> Behind, there's nothing behind the mountain. All right, no, this one's probably too hard. I don't see anything there. I don't want to lose too much time, chat. I need to know exactly where it is. Definitely not here. What about here? It must be within vision. I don't see it. I don't see it. If I don't see it, I will move on. Dragon Spine. Isn't Dragon Spine Mondstadt? Go to the TP on the lower part of Wung Wong Hill. TP of the low. I don't see anything. You guys are stressing me out. Die. Yeah, I feel like I have the same temper as Shen here. <laughs> He's talking when I'm like thinking. No, I promise you, I promise you, I've seen a shrine in Liyue that is like right there, next to a teleport. I have not opened a single shrine in Liyue, so every single one is available. Noblesse Domain? I don't even know where that is. Taishan Mansion. I don't know where Noblesse is. The domain near MT. The domain near this one here. Right? Oh my god. <laughs> How come I can't see it though? Definitely not within the vision though.
and not up here either. That's a cave. There's nothing in here. There's monsters in here. Um, I don't see anything close by. Oh, I was seen. The rocks? Where are rocks? These rocks? Oh, okay. I still don't see one. Chat my blind. My blind. I see one. That's far, though. I feel like it's closer to this. I'm pretty sure I saw it. Huh? Wait, what? Oh, there it is. But now I need another one. Property belongs to whoever finds it first. Okay, that's one. Yours now. It's difficult to follow directions in chat. Yeah, but we we're trying. We're doing our best. Try near the unlock waypoints in Mingyu Mingyu Village. Mingyu Village. Where is that? Where could that be? Like this one here. No, 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 no. Hello, hello. Nobody is late ever. Ooh, is that one? No. Nobody is late ever. So don't worry about it. In fact, I'm the one that's streaming late. There's one around up at the right of the village, left to Dragon Spine. Right of the village. Like Mingyum Village? Oh, 
Okay, but where from here, though? Left of the village? Which left? It's close to the waypoint that I didn't unlock. So I was right. I was going the right direction. I was trying to go this way, right? I just go and unlock that waypoints. It feels like the game devs for this game just really try to make the gimmicks of each nation or, or region to be as annoying as possible. Like, for Liyue, the mountains, climbing, is like the main thing. It's the most annoying thing ever. And then, you have Fontaine, swimming. It's the most annoying thing ever. And what, what is Sumeru? What, what is the gimmick for Sumeru? What is the main gimmick for Inazuma? Everything is annoying in Sumeru. <laughs> Huh? Sir, I have no time for you right now. So, um, you all said somewhere here, right? If he follows me, he's dead. I, I swear to freaking, I am going to break his skull. Oh, there it is. He's lucky. He's lucky. This has to be worth it. Like, please let it freaking be worth it. Let the record show that I verbally... Alright. Ten wishes. This is how the stream ends. Ten wishes. Here. We. Go. Three. Two. One. Wait, my game died. Oh, my mouse died. <laughs> My mouse died. <laughs> you want? Oh wait, you wanted the new villain? You want me to do uh, this guy? You want me to do this guy? For Kazuha? All right, all right, Kazuha banner. All right, here we go. Yes. Oh, purple! Oh my god! Another Barbara! I have like 20 Barbaras now! That's crazy. 135 shop. Um... Here, let's get one of these. We're having one of those. Um, now, however, however, I am going to do one roll. Um, here. Here we go. One random roll. It's uh, nothing. Alrighty. It's good. We got a Barbara though. Oh, more items. No! Oh my god, monster, stop! Freaking chasing me, dude! Leave me alone for one second! God, they're so greedy! Oh, I just literally wanted to check how many things I have for Barbara. Constellation 3. That's crazy. You know, I wish that was Shinsho. That would have been crazier. That would have actually been crazier, for sure. Uh, character. This guy has talents. I really don't know. I have to, like, farm this, too. It's it's a lot of grinding, chat. It's a lot of grinding. But, what can I say? Oh my god, they're really trying to kill me, though. 
Anyways. God. It is time. It is time that I say... It is time that I say goodbye for today. We have been here for a long time. I was not supposed to be streaming for five hours. Almost five hours. But you know what? I appreciate it if you stuck by. Um, definitely a long time. I'm tired. My mind is tired. I am mentally tired. I have a lot of work to do. <laughs> but it's it's all good. You know, it was a fun time. We went to Fontaine. Honestly, it's not that bad. Um, I'm happy. I'm happy that we got to get, you know, to through the... I got to meet Shen... 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 I think it's her name. She's pretty cool. She's amazing. She's pretty cool. Hopefully one day she comes back to the to any banners and I'll I'll definitely roll for her because I think I really like Shenhe. Um but yeah. So it was it was a pretty good adventure. Maybe next time we will do the Dainslave and also or Dainslave, whatever his name is, and Inazuma. So yeah. Thank you for watching. I will be doing Little Nightmares tomorrow. So I'm excited for that series. Please come by, you know, check it out. Uh, and watch me get uh, scared in that cute game, I guess. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. So, yeah, I'm excited for that. We'll do some Little Nightmares tomorrow. And, yeah, thanks for watching. I will see you on the next one. Janet.